And hey, 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 everybody. Hey, uh, hey, gravy, uh, gravy sauce. Hey, honey, hey. <laughs> we got Olander in the building. Olander says, hey, Kim, I finally made a live. Um, Raven says, hey, can I get your opinion on something? Shoot, hun, shoot, shoot, shoot. Hey, Miss Sharon. We got Miss Sharon in the building. I'm at work. You at work, girl. It's all good. You know how we do. And you is girl, honey. Them lies. You don't be telling nothing but the truth, though. You don't be telling nothing but the truth. You know, if it's a video, if it's a, a short, you know I support you on all of um everything that you put up. You know I watch it. Even if I don't comment. I'm still, I have seen it. I heard your words because they are words of wisdom, Miss Sharon. Everything that you say, okay? I know um, I went live uh, the day before yesterday. And y'all know how we was, uh, we was actually, we was reacting off of, <laughs> we was reacting off of me is, video where she was um honey she was talking about somebody was mad okay and that's what we was talking about and then i had i don't know what the hell i don't know what happened but all i know all i know how she said all i know <laughs> but uh I was I was interrupted and so I just um ended the live like y'all know I will do. Okay, I ended the live um whether it's like technical, audio issues or whatever the case may be. Um I ended the live and that's what we're going to pick back up it, okay? Um so today we're going to pick right back up from there. Mhm. Mm I'm going to finish what I was saying. Yep. Mm -hmm. Hey Mittens girl. Right up in here. You, she be the first. She give me thumbs up. She be in here. Crazy self. She be in here, honey. Thumbs up and everything. We be over here talking dead about her. Okay? And she still thumbs the live up. But, um, nevertheless, y'all, let's jump back into this. Uh, we're going to start it where she was actually uh, going in on the person. Okay? And as a lot of y'all have figured out, you know, um, I also agree. I think she was talking to Cindy, right? Okay. But let's, let's just listen to some of the things that she was saying about Cindy. Let me unmute this first. I'm creative, baby. <laughs> hmm. No. There is no comparison. Comparison. She creative, honey. I don't got to fight other people's style in no way, shape, form, or fashion. <laughs> and y'all know, like, uh, yesterday, we heard this. We heard her say how she was creative. And I think I was, I told her something along the lines of, you know, when she said she ain't have to bite off of nobody, she ain't have to bite off nobody's style. Honey, we ain't talking about no braids. Okay, that's what's not in comparison. That side braids you're talking about and some nails, that ain't in comparison with nothing else that's going on. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about, uh, you know, hairstyles and nails. I mean, child, if we got into that, honey, it's been so many emails. I done got so many people talking about them dang on nails, them throwback nails you be getting. Ain't no, people ain't even up on that. Them designs that you be getting, is that mittens be getting, y'all, it's like, Back in the 90s, okay? We been rock them styles, all right? Um, so, yeah, we heard all of that. But let's just, we're we going to rehear it, I guess. Tell me she ain't in comparison with, <laughs> with, with nobody. Talking to Cindy. Cindy ain't that stood in her. Sound like and a fool. Right, Can I please jump in here, y'all? I have to. Okay? I got to. I got to stop it right there. 
and let me do me. Let me say this. Ain't nobody trying to be in comparison with you, Mittens. Ain't nobody trying to be competitive with you or any of that. Okay? People are inserting their two cents. Mm-hmm. People is uh, leaving comments. Mm-hmm. People saying this. They saying that. And they got every right to. You know, they got every right to because uh, this is a platform that you chose to upload your business, you chose to upload your men, you chose to upload Ray Nett's business, your mama business, everybody business, right? And then when people leave their comments and put their two cents in on things, mittens like to come back, and as y'all can see the title, you settling, I have options. Don't get mad, girl. But one thing about it, y'all, one thing about it that leave everybody, you know, like, questioning scratching their temples whatever you want to call it one thing about it we don't even know what you're talking about okay now when you had your other channel it was what keeping it real we ain't never seen you ain't kept it real yet ain't kept it real yet you leave that to us to keep it real so if you want to say everybody really been you know running her channel this channel, the second channel, everybody else been running it because she just been telling lies. You know what I'm saying? She just been telling lies over here on the main channel when she had the second channel. It was built on lies, foundation of lies, all that. You know what I'm saying? But I have to say this. I I surmised that she was talking about Sin City because of uh she got options and she was comparing that. Sin City is married. I don't care what you say. What nobody say, how they say it, she's married, okay? She She's married. You cannot compare. That's your business if you want to be on the host row. That's you. If you want to have all these men come up and ain't nobody said nothing good about you, that's you. You bring it to YouTube, people talk about it. They, they got the rights to do that. You cannot come back and say, oh, you mad, don't get mad, girl. Who mad? Who showed that they mad? You taking shots? The, and people figuring you talking about them, so they take a shot back. Only their shot, mm -hmm, only their shot, Olander, I know, only their shot uh, is factual. Their shot is full of nothing but the truth. Your, your shots that you're taking don't be nothing but made up lies. It be made up. The truth be that came out months ago. You know, I mean, it's like, She's looking stupid. She getting the dirty end of the stick. Y'all already know. Mm -hmm. The yada yada end of the stick. Every single time. Okay? Point blank period. And that's where the delusion comes in. That's why everybody says it's, it's got to be mental illness or delusion. Because when these people talk about you, you press, you get mad at it. Oh, I'm gonna leave y'all. I'm just gonna leave y'all right there. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say nothing back. I'm not listening to that. This, but you do. So that equal. That is called contradiction. Mittens contradicts everything she come out her mouth and say, and then she turn around and get mad because people is talking about it. If you don't want you whatever you put up. If you don't want nobody to put their opinion in, you don't want nobody to bring their two cents to the table, you don't want nobody to talk about it, then you shouldn't put it up. Point blank, bottom line. There is no way around it. Ain't no if, ands, or but in between. The craziness, the delusion, people saying, yeah, she crazy, this and that. Girl, let me tell you why. Because the things that you're talking about, the things that you do, it all equals up for people to say, yeah, she's telling a lie. Because it, it just don't happen like that. It just don't happen like that. Nothing that you talk about happens like that. And then when you do want to come and tell the truth, hell, the truth will already be done, been exposed. But you was claiming that when the truth was exposed, you were saying, oh, yeah, I'm a truth teller and they lying. You were saying that the people was the people that was telling the truth the entire time, you come back, make a video, y'all. Mittens will come, make a video, go live, whatever, whatever. And say that the, that whoever, whatever they said, oh, it was all lies. It was all lies. Uh-uh, we ain't like that. We don't do that. Yeah, I do this. Yeah, I do that. Blah, 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 blah. But she was lying the entire time. 
Okay? See, this is why. See? See how it lock up on me? This is why I um I don't be using uh I don't be oh because I get to talking. But this this is why it happens all the time. Y'all hold on for me one second. Let me get something set up. Hey, cat. Glad you are in here. <laughs> okay. 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 So I think I got it um together, y'all. So we're going to start. Kat says, I'm here. Thank you so much for joining the live, honey. Um, that thing be getting on my nerves. I still have not went into my laptop, y'all, and changed my settings um, to where it did not lock so doggone quick. Because you know when I get to talking, I, I don't be thinking about that damn thing. I don't be thinking about that laptop. And, you know, but I know I need to go in the settings and I need to change it so it won't lock so doggone quick and all of that. Okay? But boom. Y'all know I got um some other devices. So let's carry on. Let's continue on, okay? Mm-hmm. Let me make sure I got this turned out for everybody. And we're gonna pick right back up to, um where we was at, okay? Y'all listen in. She said, um, she's creative. Okay, I don't got the bite of the people's style in no way, shape, form, or fashion. Never did, uh, never did, uh. Okay, so, here again, I'm going to pause it. I'm going to try to keep it brief. But I'm going to just say this. You know, we saw, uh, Mittens before. We seen her before when she was over there, um, at Raynette's, okay? We seen her in the room begging, pleading for Sin City to say something to her. We seen that, okay? So here it is again. Um, It's deja vu. She doing the same damn thing. She doing the same thing. Oh, there's no comparison. Oh, I, I don't have to bite off of nobody. Girl, what would you... First of all, you can't bite, okay? First of all, let's get that out there and open, okay? You can't bite. Um, what would you, what, what tools would you use to bite? What tools would you use to bite? You're not even in, mittens ain't even in the bracket of other women. Okay. I don't care what she say. 
It's so contradictory with her uh, income. That's contradictory. Uh, one minute she on, you know, she'll be on a stream or doing a video and she'll say, you know, she got this, she got that, all her options, she this, she that, da, 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 da. But you looking like a hoe. Hmm. Honey, I don't want to be biased, but with all them colors, <laughs> clothes, I mean, the outfit, it be warped, okay, for lack of a better word. It be warped. She be looking like a fool when she get dressed, go out, be looking like a complete fool. So, yeah, she's right. Here again, once once again, I'm going to agree with her. Mm -hmm. She can't bite off nobody. Right. Because if she didn't take, if she didn't take notes off of the tips I gave her about dressing, Y'all remember, it's over there. If she didn't take the tips I gave her about dating, it's over there too. If she didn't take the tips I gave her about her hair, okay, to be 51, then, yeah, you can't get mad and say somebody is delusional. You you cannot get mad and say, you, no, there's no way. You can look, uh, mittens is on this video right here at the end, where I started it from, Okay. We have all surmised that she is taking digs at Sin City. But, baby, you, men's, you can't, okay? You cannot. You can't take no digs at Sin City, baby. Because I'm going to tell you like this. There is no, you right, there's no comparison. Not to you, but to Sin City. You can't compare yourself to her. The only way you can compare herself, you, what? Oh, you know, uh, me and Walter got the same daddy. Okay, I done told you before. The only way that you are have any affiliation with Walter or Bethany is because Papa was a Rolling Stone, point blank, period. And it that him out there rolling, mm -hmm, him out there being a dog, it commits, it, it, it boils down to you. That's the only way. Because if not, then you would really hear your siblings, your cousins, your aunt, second cousins you will hear people talk about you child you will hear people talk about you acknowledge you because and the reason why they would do that is because you say you're a guru you're a legend you've been out here for so many years so if you're a guru and a legend you like a celebrity you've been out here for so many years plus you be loves sister right okay then them people would talk about you. Even the Mills would talk about you. Honey, the Mills even doggone. Everybody done um, brushed you under the rug. They are uh, really, they don't claim you. You know what I'm saying? They don't, I mean, we know. We Y'all know. Everybody out here know. Everybody out here know. Them people don't fool with mittens, edge, way. Point blank, period. Okay? Now, she keep on, we've all said that, yeah, she, she talking to um Sin. But, Mittens, don't you see? It Don't you see? It look like you, you're doing the same thing you did month, a couple months ago when you was in, in that back bedroom over there at Unk House. It looks like the same thing. When you said, girl, you you hear me call. You, you, you ain't going to say nothing back to the woman that's, that, that's talking to you, that's calling your name, that's this, that, and the third. It look like you're begging. It looked like you're begging. And that equals to clout chasing. Okay? That equals to clout chasing. You are at the... For you to be such a guru, mittens. Okay? Because I know you're in here, girl. You're listening. But for you to be such a guru and a legend, you shouldn't have to do the stuff that you're doing, baby. You is a celebrity out here. According to you, coming out your mouth. You like a celebrity out here. You done told women to suck out your butt. Oh, honey, if they caught you with a man, they wouldn't do nothing but watch. You done said so much stuff about everybody. Mm. But here you go. You done went back and forth with Sin City. But here you go again. Subliminally, low-key, <laughs> begging her. Begging her. And sin, if you see this video, honey, if you tap in, girl, please, don't say nothing to her. Don't give her what she want. She want a reply. She want a reply. We can tell. The nine, ten-minute videos that she putting up on that train, sitting there, I ain't never seen such junk 
in my life? And that's another, when we get to it, that's another question I got y'all. So stay tuned, stay tuned. But for now, let's finish off with what she had to say to Sin City. Mm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me do me over here. At any rate, y'all, tell you about the dismiss because I see that I'm, I'm going to have to dismiss her once again, you know, um, and just. Can uh 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 no ma'am, no ham, chat gone. What this lady talking about? But stay saying she not bothering nobody. Right. Right, Miss Sharon. But, honey, I got to jump in there. When? Dismiss her when? When did she dismiss sin? When did she dismiss her? After all that begging and pleading and crying and shaking and twisting that she was doing over there in Uncle Ray next back room equals her little cell. Mm -hmm. All we saw with her right hand on her hip talking about a dang on date. A date that we ain't seen since then. Mm -hmm. A date that... What? The man was trying to be a date. He was trying to be a man and take her to a comedy show. We ain't seen the man no more. You know, because the man got an eye fool. He seen all he needed to see. The, the conversation wasn't hitting on yada yada. The conversation wasn't hitting on nothing. She pulled out the phone on a doggone date at a comedy show and ain't recording nothing. Ain't recording nothing ain't saying nothing and guess what we ain't seen her no more she didn't get a second date and that's another thing i gave her tips on that how to get a second date can't say i didn't because it's over there it ain't going nowhere see unlike mittens i ain't removing stuff because i don't want nobody to see it mm -mm. it's over there she done got tips on everything starting with the hair on down to the shoes she put on her feet Okay, everything else in between. She talking about she got to dismiss. <laughs> Ain't that funny? She got to dismiss her again. Girl, Sin City wrapped that Rick Ross, Rick Flair wig around her fingers and drug mittens. Okay, and drug mittens. Cindy wasn't caring about your knees and nothing else. Cindy drug you for filth. Wow. Wow, she was on her way to take care of business or whatever she was doing. The same way she drew somebody else while she was getting ready for work. Cindy ain't out here sending no dogs on checker flags, waving no white flags. She ain't out here trying to create no drama or create no peace. Point blank, period. She not out here messing with a soul. Okay, she's doing what anybody else, what all of us can do. We got devices. We got phones. It's our right to go uh, in somebody's chat. They putting it up there. Hmm. They don't want you in there. They'll block you. Period. Most people, if, if you don't, uh, they know you, you don't fool with them. They don't want you in. You don't want them in your on your page, in your chat. So what? They still come. <laughs> they still come. I never seen such clock chasing in all my life. And mittens, mm -hmm, prime example she's the prime example hey dakota right welcome into the chat she's the prime example of clout chasing dakota says i just subscribed to you thank you so much dakota i appreciate your support honey and tapping on the chat that means everything over here in tfz stay tuned girl because you are so if you know what's going on how was your my afternoon is going good hope yours is but y'all listen, let's jump back. Honey, I got to get rid of this lady. What's she doing in these dang on ads? Hold up, y'all. Okay, here we go, y'all. Hold on. I mean, I'm I'm so sorry, y'all, that I have to keep stopping it because it's like everything that she says is contradictory. It's like anybody, everybody who react, talk about whatever, everybody got a comeback. They got something to say about every sentence that come out her mouth because every sentence makes no sense. 
Like nobody is happy because you're doing bad. You're doing bad because of your own decisions. Because you, you tell so many lies and then them lies, they boomerang. They come back and they slap you in the face, mittens, point blank. You told these people that uh, Waldo was your ride or die and Waldo this and Wal Waldo had all this going on. Waldo stay over there in a five-bedroom house, da-da-da. But Waldo seen you out in the cold. Waldo, mm-hmm. Ain't really hitting on yada yada. Okay? And it's there to be broken down and to be talked about because it doesn't make sense. Why? Why? If that day when y'all was quote unquote mm -hmm, car shopping, he said on camera, his cousin sell cars, his cousin go to auctions, you sitting right over there in the passenger seat. Okay? Yo dumb self, you recording, don't even know what he's saying. Okay? It take me to come through and say, oh, well, if he a car if his cousin is a car salesman, then that means that his cousin know a person and the person know a person and a person know a person. And y'all know it's a domino effect. Come on now. If you know, if you're a car salesman, you got all kind of connect, all kind of connections, all kind of people to come through with what you need. And you a car salesman, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so boom. She said on camera, when he walked across, that gravel parking lot, mm -hmm, when she was sitting in that dirty car, okay? Y'all look at him. Oh, uh, he got off of work to come. And that was a lie to come and bring me car shopping up here. And that was a whole lie. And she know that was a lie. She know that was a lie. He got in the car and said, yeah, my cousin sell cars. Oh, really? Well, Waldo already knew that she was looking for a truck. So where did this rust bucket come in at? See, that's the thing. You try to, Mittens tries to confuse everybody. She try to confuse everybody because she make 10 million videos a day. Okay? But and she want people to forget about the lies that she be done told. Because the lies that she be done told, it, they does not equate to the lies with what we seeing. They, don't, they do not equate to anything that we are seeing. So, we connect the dots. We put two and two together and boom. We come up with the truth that way. It don't make no sense in nothing that she says. Y'all, come on. I know y'all feel me. Hold on. Honey, please listen. They miserable and the whole world can see. Can we please talk about that? Uh, the person who uh, she said everybody miserable and the whole world can see. Where? Where they miserable at? Because it's only looking like you the one who miserable, only you doing a job um, hiding it. You putting on a whole, men's out here putting on a whole facade. She putting on a whole facade, like seriously. She is living in a whole bubble, putting on a whole facade. Where, where do you mean to tell me? Where anybody, okay? Let's start off with your mama. She not miserable. Because you there, that make her miserable. When you not there, that make her miserable. Because it look like to me she doing good. House clean. Got a car. Her and Hammy look good. They clean. They dressed. You showed her food in the freezer. Huh? Got so, she got food for days. Food for months. How is that looking like she miserable? She said uh, uh, when you was out there showing them dang on tomatoes in the garden. The, the, um, the neighbors downstairs. You said I touched on my mouth. Yeah, they helped my mama. So how, how mama meant is, is so miserable. Okay, let's move on to Raynette. Raynette, she over there living in her little Section 8 house, okay? It might not be as clean, and it might not be all that as her sister's mama mittens, but it's hers. It's clean, mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure Raynette, she got uh, she got her kids coming through. She got her grandkids coming through. They be over there playing. She don't seem all that miserable, whether she drank, smoke, or whatever, okay? She don't seem all that damn miserable. So who miserable? Y'all, this is another lie. It's another way of her to make them new nutty buddies, old nutty buddies, and anybody else who know they nutty buddies who hanging on her word, mm -hmm, cling to the, the yada yada that she be saying. That stuff don't even make sense. Who miserable? Who miserable girl? We're talking about the whole world can see it. See what? Where? Please. Tell us what the misery you talking about. The misery that you talking about. We want to know. All the viewers, the subscribers, everybody wants to know what you're talking about. Who miserable and what the whole world see? Can you be more specific? Please. 
Break some things down like everybody breaking things down on you. Stop using wordplay. Stop using that, that wordplay that you done picked up when you was doing that time. Stop using that wordplay. Huh? Just be real like you say. Mm-hmm. Like you said you was with your other channel when you had it. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying. Hmm. Child, please. Girl, mid, uh, uh, mittens. I know, Orlando. Thank you, boo. Exactly, Ken. I'm just saying. We all want to know. These people that come into my lives, they're not just coming into my lives. They, they done heard the lies that you done said. These people watch your lives. Some of these people dog going to be in ops lives. Okay? Some of these people hear people that be dra call themselves dragging me. Okay? And then they be right back over here. But, but one thing about it. I don't care who you're dragging. You can talk till your tongue turn blue. You can say what you want to say about me. But one thing about it. I'm giving it to you really uncut. The way life really goes. The way life really goes. This is 2024. This ain't 2014. Girl, go head on. You still stuck on telling me, oh, that big bag that Walt had when he called me. Honey, well, I was there. And I know what it was. I know what it was. When it all boiled down to it, he sure did call you because you stayed in his left ear. You stayed in his damn left ear as the sister, like most sisters do. Mm-hmm. Like most family members that really don't have nothing. They don't got no uh, best interest in, at heart for you. They just stay in your ear because they don't want to see you happy. They don't want to see you with more than what they got. Point blank, period. Family or not. Friends is like that, too. You keep talking about doggone Cindy. For what? Cindy, if we take it all the way back, y'all, Cindy never did anything to her. She started that damn rip with Cindy. Honey, she started when, when, when uh, uh, Corona had first came out. She started that doggone rip with Cindy. Uh-huh. Cindy and Walt's relationship was on the rocks. And she knew it. She stayed in Walt's damn ear. She stayed calling Walt's phone for her own, for her own interest. Not for no Walt's interest. Okay? And she started that rip. Because what she thought, oh, yeah. I can do my lies and I can do, uh, let Walt stay with me and I can blow up like this. I can blow up. Mm -hmm. But it backfired. Like everything else backfires on that big hungry. What can't say? Itch. Everything backfires on her. I'm just saying. <laughs> Y'all, let's listen to it. Because, honey, we're going to go to another one after this. Nobody can listen to this whole thing it's full of nothing but lies. Say what now? What say what? She say just do what I do and let the world see that. What do you do? You out here with a whole question mark on your forehead, honey. It's been months ago that I talked about that. Remember, you sent the challenge out. Uh, uh, talking about show a man, show a man challenge, and mm, I seen some other challenges, but I know I was one of them. I actually showed my man. <laughs> okay, you ain't responded yet, so you can throw men can throw a challenge out. But when the challenge is thrown to her, she don't accept. Mm. Now, that's what you call fake punking at its best. That's called fake punking. That's called frauding. That's called clout chasing. That's called every derogatory word, descriptive word that you want to term it as. Okay? Point blank, period. You the one threw that uh, challenge out there. I stepped up to it. She ain't came back. Now, you say, uh, just do what I do. What, what else you doing? What else you doing instead of telling lies? Uh, 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 instead of telling lies, sleeping with Tom, Dick, and Harry, uh, scamming, mm -hmm. uh, me, uh, girl, what else is you doing? What else is you doing? It's uh, passing germs around. Mm -hmm. It's people like you that start these new pandemics, you know. Let's just be real about it. It's people like you, okay? You one of them. So all this gypsy life, honey, go over there with the gypsy life. Live it, live it, and be happy with it. And be happy with it. Do you. Do you. Tell me, uh, uh, what she say? Let me do what I do. Just do what I do. Girl, if you don't go somewhere and sit down, I done told you, it's so many things that people want to talk about. Girl, you got a long, long list of questions, a long list of deceptive.
de I mean, deception is lies that you done told, things that you have not addressed, things, questions that you ain't answered, won't answer. You won't answer if people, I mean, literally gave you a whole pig, uh-huh, that you can set up on a grill, one of them grills that you turn round and round and let the pig cook on, because we know you, you love salted meat. We know you love more than salt. We know you love it. We know you greedy. We know everything about you. We know you like the back of our hand. See, it was at one time she thought she was on cloud nine. Mm -hmm. It was other content creators that was bringing her on their panel. Uh huh. Like they really had a dang on. Uh, Dakota said she a farmer and an EMT. Okay, girl. All right now. Uh, people bringing her on a panel like she was really doing something like they had somebody up there. Mm, but that was before the truth started coming out about her. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. hmm. Let's talk about that. Honey, they ain't had her back up on that damn panel. To making their damn channel look bad. Mm -mm. Child bye. Y'all listen. You are. I told you yesterday, the day before, you was stuck. Look, and then she go to laughing. I told you the day before yesterday, I don't care what you say. I don't care what you say and how you say it and how you try to put that Jezebel voice on it to make people even further believe you. You still stuck in the damn rut. You go so far one day, oh, yes, that mama, uh, yes, she needs me. Huh. But, yeah, I heard your last video, she don't need you. She don't need you there. Uh, you was pleading to the people, trying to justify mm -hmm, why you was going on the road. And where you meet that man at? Plenty of fish, because we ain't see him. Huh? You done met somebody on plenty of fish. Now she finna get on the train. Uh-huh. Don't know if she walking into her last day walking on this earth or not. <laughs> I'm just saying. Let's make it all make sense. Let's keep it real, mittens. Let's keep it real. You got a platform over here that's so, you you a legend, you a guru, you're bigger than everybody else, and all y'all bees need to suck out my ASS, uh-huh, lick the crumbs off of my butts. I mean, suck, suck, suck. Go, oh, do this, because I do this, and I'm that. Yeah, y'all copying off of me, y'all doing this. Uh-huh. Well, okay. Well, let's see where. Let's talk about where. Because if not, I'm damn sure going to talk about, I'm going to talk about it all. I'm going to, I don't care if I got to take it way down the street to the Circle K, back up the street to the Shell Station, then take a pit stop over here to QT. I don't care. We going to talk about it. Girl, you ain't been doing nothing but lying to these people. We going to talk about it, honey. And I'm, I'm going to pop you every single time. Every single time. Because remember now, remember a couple days ago, oh, mama needs me. Ooh. Mama needs you, mm. but just just you was ranting and raving, talking about how, oh, yeah, I deserve that. I deserve, I got needs. Needs? Girl, you ain't got no needs. Honey, that thing been closed up like a damn shell. You ain't got no needs. Huh? How you got needs and you, mm, 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 mm. Who, child? Y'all hold on. Y'all hold on, honey.
Thank y'all so much for that um for hanging in here. I had to step away for a second. But I uh Sharina Bella said, yes, Kim, lying day and night. Mm-hmm. Telling all kind of lies. Don't make no sense. It don't make no sense to be 51. You ain't secure in what come out your mouth. You ain't you you say you so uh uh confident in your skin, but yet and still you got to tell all these lies. Who gonna bend you over and whoop you? So her imaginary needs come before her mom, who only can use one hand, according to her. You know what? Miss Sharon, her mama might have whatever happened to her arm. But it ain't that bad, okay? It ain't that bad where she need no mittens. If that's the case, I'm pretty sure. If that's the case, I am pretty damn sure that she can get an aid to come in there. Point blank, period. Let's just keep it real. It ain't to the point where she need her. It's not to the point where she's handicapped. That is not to the point. Okay? The point is, the matter of it all is that Mama Mittens don't need her. She needs Mama Mittens. Okay? Y'all hear it in the videos. Y'all watching? I told y'all, y'all don't be paying attention to her words, so y'all just be looking. Y'all just be looking at the uh, at the stuff at the uh, scenery. Y'all just be looking at the thumbnails that she put up from 30, 40 years ago. I told y'all to listen to her the words that she say. Put the put the stories that she talk about. I'm just saying, if you're gonna lie, make it good. Right. Mm -hmm. Put the stories that she talk about, them lies. All you got to do is Listen to the last video. Uh huh. Put it to the last lies you heard, and then then you you, you gonna draw the truth right there. She tells the truth. She don't. She really don't even know how today ain't gonna make up a story and tell it, cause she be done forgot the stuff that she done said in her last live or video. Okay. <laughs> Seriously, straight up. Mama do not need her. She ain't been needing her. She didn't need her when she was down in. When Mittens thought she was on cloud nine and had everything in her favor, she wasn't studying no dang on Mama Mittens. She wasn't studying Mama Mittens' help. You think she was studying when we found out uh, Raynette was sending her all that money? Mm-hmm. Not once did she say, yeah, I got to take a trip back home. Uh-huh. The last time we seen her home is when she drug her mama about that dang her, her uh, Thanksgiving food last year. And come to find out, since she got so many options, so many men, so many ex-boyfriends up there, then why she couldn't get back home? Remember, the brother was going to come through, and he was going to pay for it to get back to Florida? Hmm? Homegirl was so dang gone broke, she couldn't even get back home. Ken ain't even get her back home. But, you know, Ron, that time, oh, yeah, Ken said he going to always take care of me as long as I'm living. He going to do this. He going to do that. Da, 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 da. Oh, but then when she got to Milwaukee, Thanksgiving, mm-hmm. You know, I was telling y'all, I was like, look at her, y'all. Honey, she so dark, she can't get no hits. She can't get, she can't jam. She can't do none of that. So she was, at, she was literally going through withdrawals. She was literally going through withdrawals on camera. Y'all just didn't see it. Y'all just didn't catch it. Y'all just didn't catch it. But I caught it because I talked about it. Mm -hmm. All you do is want to tell these people lies and, you know, paint a pretty picture. I'm this and I'm that, da, 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 da. Okay, boom, let's see. Okay, Ken is the greatest man God ever let live. And Ken ain't going to never let you go without. And Ken, 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 let's see. Huh. Got all the way to Milwaukee where Ken is at. Hmm. Ken didn't even come through. And neither did the damn brother. She told that lie about the brother. And the damn brother didn't come through. That fell through. That lie. She goes to mama for a sympathy vote. Mama D ain't going to let her have free reign in her house and driving her car going, God's nowhere. Yeah. I'm just saying, Sally. I'm just saying. With, honey, the people you talk about, girl, ain't nobody forgot. All we got to do is talk about them dang on videos from way back when, last month or last year or whatever. Jog people memories a little bit. Ain't nobody forgot like that, boo. You might have done private them mittens. You might have done private to th those videos and deleted them or whatever you did. Where well, they can't be viewed. Mm-hmm. But people that was there, girl, you cannot delete that. 
You can't delete people's memories. She messed up right in that house and getting kicked out of there. She done. Huh. I'm just saying. Because one thing about it, Sally, she's not going to, she is not going to actually, um, she's not going to tell everybody. She's not going to tell everybody what's going on over there in Raynette's house. She's not going to do that. She's only going to record what looks good. She's only going to say what she think people want to hear. She's not going to tell that left people, this whole mess when she jumped from mama, she put all that on. Oh yeah, mama. She, uh, she put all that on mama D. Oh, because Mama D went to the hospital, so now I'm over here at her house and I'm taking care of Hammy. Look how she talk about Hammy, this shitty pissy dog. She been thought that. It's just that now she got a reason to come out and say it. She been thought that about him. She was using, she was using Hammy to make a video. She, when she took him in the grocery store, she was using him because she's a narcissist. That attention, you know, narcissists like the spotlight. She was using Hammy that day in the store. But then we seen the Jazzy bet. We saw what Renee come out. Mm-hmm. You know, Renee is the lady with the other voice. Uh-huh. I believe she got kicked out of there. She needs a tent in the middle of a she needs a tent in the middle of the desert. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Mm-hmm. She was lying. She was lying, y'all. She was lying, lying, lying. So much stuff. Just like uh, Gail Stone. She been lying about that. She don't, She never did own no damn Gail Stone. She ain't gave nobody no three damn bands for no Gail Stone. She ain't never lied. She ain't never owned no Gail Stone. That was just the lie she ran with. And I done showed y'all where anybody and their grandma can walk up and go in a dang on mobile home and view it. Mm -hmm. Them people, they don't escort you in there. They don't usher you in there. They let you go in there and stay as long as you damn want to. You ain't spending the night, but they let you go in there. You know her videos ain't but what? We're going to say a maximum be 12 minutes. Uh-huh. Who can't go in a dang on mobile home mm -hmm. and make a 12-minute video swearing up and down his deals? She ran with that damn lie for I don't know how long, for months on end. She ran with that lie. Now, all of a sudden, oh, I don't, I don't know why. You know, I just got caught up and, you know, looking at them van life videos and I went and got a van. Itch, you know that wasn't, you know for a fact that was what you wanted to do all along. No the hell. You came with that lie. Oh, yeah, I got this mobile home. That short she put up where that man was backing it in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She might have gave him some money down. She might have paid that first month's rent, but that's it. That's it. That's it. Thinking she was to come because she know she will get more views and clicks that are up her money on her check. Uh-huh. And she ran with that story. She don't own no damn girl stone because I keep telling y'all she had a, a, her energy was on 10 when she showed the supposed to be supposed degree that piece of paper. But her energy wasn't on 10 when she showed the blue keychain. Supposed to be for Gailstone. So why you, it's been two instances now. Two instances. Two instances. You showed the degree. And she showed, oh, I got my license. I'm shocked. Da, 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 da. Sounding like a pit bull. And she, the degree and the license. So it's one instance that you're leaving out. You didn't have that energy and show anything on Gailstone. Hmm. That just leads me to say, hmm. And start connecting the dots. That makes no sense. Okay? So by her saying something and keep on taking these little low blows at Cindy, that's to throw you off. Making these videos, that's to throw you off. That is to throw you off, y'all. That is to create a doggone diversion. That's to create a smoke screen so everybody can forget and won't be talking about Gail Stone. She want everybody now on this new man she's supposed to be meeting. She uh, traveling on that train ha uh, halfway around the world to go see and don't even know nothing about the man. Because if you knew, you're, you're like a celebrity out here. According to me, it's, I'm like a celebrity out here. People follow me. I've been out here since 2017. This, that, I'm this. I'm, I'm a guru. I'm a legend. Well, damn. According to you, why you not showing these people where you going? You going on a trip because you deserve it and you got needs. Uh-huh. See, I got needs. You just telling everybody that you're going to lay up. 
you're going to, uh, or whatever you're going to do, if you're going to drop down on them big, th them, them big broke down knees, we don't know. Showing the trees out there in the desert, all this. Girl, you're not making sense to say you're a guru and a legend, but then the stuff that you actually put up for people to see is not correlating, boo. It's, it, it don't even look right. It looks savage. It's tacky. It, and it makes you look like you are what everybody says. A pathological liar, a person walking around, taking all these meds, got all these diagnoses, and who really is, I don't care. I don't care what nobody say. She'll tick a time bomb. It just might ain't happen yet. Hell, it's been ticking time bombs out here. They done carried on with life. They living life. They blending in. Got friends going out to eat, taking pictures. Ah, oh, boom. And they snap. And they snap. I'm just saying, we're keeping it real, okay? We don't uh, leave no dang on I's undotted. We don't leave no T's uncrossed with a whole bunch of dang on fabrications and lies. We just talk about it for how it could be. We talk about it for how it could be, for how it is, okay? Because I see it every day, and that's what we do. We just talk about it. She is using her whole platform for lies. Her whole platform, her whole existence, her whole being as the guru that she says she is, she the legend. Well, why is it that your whole legacy is built on lies? Your whole entire legacy is built on lies. See, Bethany gave her the blueprint. She gave her the blueprint. Mm -hmm. But her hatred, her hatred for uh, Bethany, it was sidetracked. Her hatred for Bethany, Nate, and everything they got going on, who God only knows the thoughts that she was in her head against Bethany after that lady then literally built your YouTube channel, literally. Because if it wasn't for her, she'd be dead. If it wasn't for her, everything, everything would be like non-existent. Like for real, when they, they snatched the big channel, you know, uh... Everything, I mean, if it was not, I'm telling you, y'all, everything, there would be no coming back from the things that we done seen, okay? It took, just, just, uh, you're right, Kim, she did that for all of them, yes. Teresa said, hey, Teresa, how is everybody doing? And like you said, Kim, she wakes up every day just to get on YouTube and live, right? I mean, right, and, and that's why I say, no, this is where I left out, we was talking, Okay, this is where I left off when we was talking and I, um, excuse me, I had that technical audio, whatever kind of dif difficulty I had, okay? But this is where we left off and this is where we picking up, okay? This is where we picking up. But this is where we talking about those lies. We talking about all this stuff. You keep, oh, I just got my 1K. Girl, honey, most people ain't worried. There is some people who don't care about oh yeah my 1k dollar this dollar that girl ain't nobody caring about that get you if it wasn't for the people clicking on your videos you wouldn't get you 1k point blank period point blank period you wouldn't even have your 1k so we don't care about that because everybody know at the end of the day it's the people that you talk about the ones that's so fat they're so jealous of you the ones that need to suck out your butt it's those people that's keeping you alive means okay i want you to know that hands down don't you ever forget that. I don't care if you went to Australia on the train. Mm -hmm. I don't care where. The Haiti. The, uh, uh, the boondocks. Girl, you can go to the boondocks. Okay? In an air balloon. Don't nobody care. It's the people that's over here clicking on your videos, watching them, commenting in your channel that's keeping you alive. And where she at? She talking like she's going to the Bahamas or something. Yeah. Down in Alabama. Riding through on that train. Looking like she in the country like the country with hoods in parentheses uh-huh like seriously did y'all see that nine minutes of what nothing in all caps hmm but this is coming from a guru a youtube guru a youtube legend mm-hmm she know everything remember she said on that bed oh i'm good at editing I'm, uh, uh, my editing skills been great Mm, but we're not seeing it. All these people seeing is that same one transition that you keep on doing. Done learned that transition and that's it. That's all. Big nasty lazy self. She ain't even got it in her to learn. 
all these apps out here. She didn't got it in her to download some and learn. Get, put the time in. Okay? I'm, I'm trying to highlight the lies. That's what I'm trying to do. Now she talking about them people. 575, dry bacon. 575. <laughs> 575, well, you the one who went and spent bands on it. Okay? And, and YouTube about to pay you. You done put in your month's worth of making a thousand videos. So you good. Uh-huh. You good. And Sally said, down the road at some man's house. Huh? She's on the train. Yep. She she on the train. Huh? Some 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 desperate old man that sent her the money to get on that tra uh, train. Go to where he at. She don't even know him. Don't know if she going to uh, Jeffrey Dahmer's house. She don't know if she meeting up with the next son of Sam. She don't know if she meeting up with somebody like Charles Manson. She don't know. She just going. Now, I'm speculating because I'm reacting, right? <laughs> but she ain't showed him. That's why I can speculate. That's why I can. Hey, Cameron. Thanks for tapping in the live. That's why I can, y'all, because she she comes through with lies, which leaves it open for people to draw their conclusions and react if that's what they want to do. <laughs> I'm just saying. Girl, don't tell my us get mad. Honey, you the one. She's not going to show him either. And who cares if she do or if she don't? We already on to a camera. We know her. We don't care if she show him or if she don't. Only thing we're going to do is doggone backtrack to the one she didn't show. He ain't no, we're going to say he ain't no better. He ain't no better than um, uh, uh, Tom Hanks with the guitars. Mm -hmm. He ain't no better than none of the other ones that she didn't show. Okay? She got tired of showing the pedophile because I stayed on the neck about that. Okay? People got tired of seeing the dang on pedophile. And we know he's a pedophile. His records done been put up on YouTube. Everybody know everything about him. It's question marks like, how you in love with a man that slept with a 10-year-old girl? And he raped her on top of that. Huh? That don't even make sense. Like, what? What kind of freak is you? It was all, girl, honey, child. Child, please. I stayed on that so dang on long. Honey, she stopped showing that. And then I told her, you might as well hang it up. He done found him another supply that's just as dumb as you was. Okay? And he good with that over there. This supply, she's not like you. Now, she might be slow in the mind because she know that something ain't right with him. She sleep with him. She got to know. You know what I'm saying? She got to know. How he move. You know what I'm saying? Every move he makes, she got to know. She sleep with him. So she know it's something that's off with Ken. She might don't know everything like uh, Mittens know, but she know it's something off with him, right? But whatever the case may be, he over there with her. He over there with her and a business, uh-huh, and the kids, the family. They taking pictures, stuff he didn't even do with Mittens. Stuff he didn't even do with Mittens. Mittens, and I told her, y'all, on a live man, girl, leave that dang on woman alone. And I mean that man. Leave them alone. Leave Paula. Leave Chester. Okay, leave them alone. The man don't want you. You can go ahead on with that. I'm going to throw you and your hoe up under the bus. Don't nobody want to hear that no more. Child, go ahead on. The, the karma came back. The boomerang hit, and it turned around, and it hit your ass in the face. Boom. That's how that happened. She was wrong. Mm -hmm. She was wrong. When she found out that Ken did that, she bought that man. Oh, I'm in love with this, huh? And tried to beat him in everybody's doggone head. What woman out here going to be in love with a man that slept with the whole child and she know about it? And her defense was, you know, I, 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 I could get past what he did to that little girl, you know, but, um, because I ain't got no kids. Huh? Who? You say who now? That was my train of thought. So after I laid, I kept on, I kept on telling y'all, I, I mean, you know, that just, I just don't believe that. I mean, that is just like, uh, rocket science to me. That's far out to me. I just didn't believe it. I just laid on that so much. She don't even show that man no more. When I told her, good child girl, leave that man alone. Leave that man alone. He done paid his debt to society. He now trying to live a normal life with Paula and them kids. You know what I'm saying? If he did what it what he did to that little girl, it is what it is. We'll cross that bridge when it, when we hear about uh Ken, mm -hmm, that beast done came back out and he done did something to them kids. Cause it's out there. Everybody know. It's Paula. She she wanna act like it ain't out there. She wanna turn a blind eye. That's on her. Cause you know I told y'all it's plenty of women like that. They know what's up. They know what's up. Trust me. They know what's up. Mm-hmm. 
Back to her, though. Hmm. Sally says, Teresa, stop. O options must not be nothing. The way she talks them up, she shouldn't want for nothing. Nothing at all, Sally. Nothing at all. She shouldn't want for nothing at all. You are so right. Nothing at all. Mm-hmm. Nothing at all. And what I tell y'all, got that dang on uh, messy, because I'm going to call it messy. I'm, I'm, a, I'm sorry. I'm going to forever call it messy. She got that damn van. It won't crank. If it do crank, it's all the way up on H. He got all kind of blankets hanging out the window. All kind of dang on a uh, concoction she done made, curtains. She got a, uh, what she say? Love lives here. She got all kind of stuff hanging up like a dang. Who child. I, I, honey, I know y'all can hear them in my voice. Just don't make no sense the stuff she had up. And then you know we got these Karens out here. You know we got these Karens. Mm-hmm. And y'all know what Karens is. Karen's is them dang on women, honey, that go off about anything. You ain't nobody finna tell me that wherever me, uh, 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 Uncle Ray stay, that them people ain't finna call. If that's where, oh, no, it's at the garage now, ain't it? Uh-huh, it's at the garage because she said that she owe $5.75 for them to fix it. Mm. Yeah, they got over on you. They got on, over on you. But you know what? They got over on you, mittens, because you told the people, you told us, Everybody watching that Waldo, Waldo was this. He knew about cars. His cousin sold cars. He was a good man. He did. He loved you unconditional. Da 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 da. You went on and on. Yo, yo, so before you even bought it, before you even bought it, Waldo should have told, oh no, don't get them people your money. I'm just saying. Any man I'm messing with and any man, any other same woman messing with, they man would have told them, what the hell you look like giving them people this, that, and the third? And girl, did y'all even test drive the dang on car? Did y'all, did y'all test drive it? One look at that rust. Oh, no. Mm-mm. I'm not going to be riding around in something that's got a whole big thing of rust on the side. And I'm talking, oh, I can cut that off and put something on. Huh? Who? What? Say who now? Girl, go ahead. On. Oh. Lies. She said the man was going to help her get the van fixed is an op now. Yeah, now he an op. See, Teresa, you must have missed my live uh, the day before yesterday, honey. We went into that. Mm -hmm. We went into that, girl. We went deep, too. We went deep, too. Because how that man that you just met going to be an op? Mm-hmm. Girl, go back and listen to that. We went in on that, honey. We sure did. Yeah, we sure did. Talking about he's an op now. How you don't know him? He ain't never did nothing to you. How that man an op? No. He ain't no op. Then he just broke. Okay, Teresa Cameron says eating a damn Lunchable. <laughs> and you notice, y'all didn't even see any other time. You'll see. She'll, she'll uh, record that. Mm -hmm. you, you don't hear no smacking now. Mm-hmm. Teresa said, dang, yes, I missed that one. And I definitely will go watch the replay. Thank you, honey. It's over there. Mm-hmm. But you know, I was telling y'all before, honey, that smacking. I said, uh-uh. Why she, remember she was in the car with uh, Waldo? And I said, y'all notice, I paused it. I said, hold up. Y'all notice she ain't smacking? She not smacking? Mm. See, I had told y'all months ago. I said, oh, she modifying She's modifying those uh, dentures. You know how everybody been saying that them was Mama Mitten's dentures, right? And I just didn't understand, you know, for the life of me. I was like, well, you know, I don't know. But then I started to pay attention. And it, and it goes all the way back to when she was with Derek. And the, the left side of her face was real swollen. And I was like, oh, that's because... Something is going on. It was like when she was dating Derek. And I know Derek wasn't beating on her or nothing. She ain't got in no fight because we would have knew about that. So the only thing, because she did not mention it to anybody, but it was so, if y'all, if, if, if you can remember or, or if you want to go back and find, I don't know. But it was there when she, uh, she was sitting across from Derek and they was at a restaurant and that jaw was swollen. And I said, oh, because she playing with those dentures she's playing with those dentures that's why and, and it probably was irritating i don't know 
It probably was irritating her or whatever the case may be. But that side of her face was swollen. I caught it. I caught it. And I said it in live. Now, on down the line, that's when things started to... Um, it wasn't adding up for one, but things started to come to pass with Mama Mittens and... Uh, the the dent it just it just used to be you know a whole lot of questions because people ask me or send me pictures in my email and they would be like well dog Brazzy, one minute she got the chip right here the next minute she don't what's going on and one time I had tagged her in a community post and I was like listen me people is asking me and I don't know. Because I ain't your dentist. I ain't in your mouth. But what you want me to tell these people, girl? Honey, go. It's over there in my channel, honey. It's over there in my channel, honey. Anything I'm saying, honey, I ain't lying about it. I ain't fabricating. I ain't making up nothing. I ain't talking out my neck. You're going to get the real over here. Okay? If that's what we talking about, you're going to get the real. Period. Point blank. Honey, I just done. Let's jump back into this video. Y'all already done heard it. Y'all done seen it. Ha! <laughs> but listen, y'all. And she thinks that that sounds good. I can be off to the next. Wow. You know, and one thing I can say is that, hey, you know, at my age, 51, um, I'm very glad and very grateful that I have options. No, you're not. Girl, that's a facade. Honey, you telling lies. No, you're not. She said at her age, 51, she's very glad that she has options and um you know she the type that can jump from one to the next i mean if she think that that's cool she think that's good to you know uh brag about being a whore you know being coming out the whole stroll and being able to jump from one man to the next you know if she think that sound cute that's on her you know that's on her that's her type of woman okay it is what it is, but at 51 years old, boo, I'm going to just go ahead and tell you, and I'm going to keep it real with you. Oh, no, ma'am, no ham, no turkey, or bologna. No, ma'am, you ain't no damn happy that you by yourself. You ain't got nobody in your corner. Not shit. No, ma'am, I don't care what you say. Now she fin on a, yeah, I'm on this short, I'm finna go on this short trip, the whole life got on a plane. Girl, why he ain't coming to you? Why he ain't come to you since it's such a short trip? Why you had to get on the dog on trying to go up there to see him? Huh? Why that man ain't dry to you? Hmm? Ain't you the prize? <laughs> or is he the prize? Because he got what you're looking for. Huh? Got to go up there and work for it, girl. You starting off wrong. Every every man that come in the doggone picture, y'all, she start off wrong. She start off doing stuff wrong. That's why it don't last. Ain't nobody tell, teach her how to be a doggone, let her tell it. She's the black Marilyn Monroe. She's so sexy. She's so glad she did, she that. Honey, where did you get your teachings from then? Must have been from, uh, what was that madam's name? Madam Lollarie. What, y'all, that Madam Dinance, uh, New Orleans. Must have got your teachings from her on how to be a whore, a hoe, a, a hoe, hoe monger. A Jezebel. Because even the doggone madams, honey, they teach you top notch. They gonna sit down and give it to you one on one, honey. Now, nah, this is how you do with them men. This is how you get what you want, this, that, and the third. They gonna give you the game. And they gonna give it to you correct. They not gonna give it to you half ass like the stuff we seeing. She on a doggone train eating a Lunchable going to a man. Huh? But yet it's still you this and you that. Girl, go ahead. Oh, mittens now. Oh, child. Y'all, hmm, let's, let's visit this next video.
y'all okay so this one um is when she was it's 10 minutes okay it's when she was so i'm so excited to get away <laughs> Mm, 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 mm. So, it was one question, y'all, in her um comments. And Lisa Newsom, she asked her, why don't you find a rental yard for your mobile home and stay there so you can be close to your mother and save some money at the same time, right? She hearted it, but she did not reply, okay? She didn't reply. So, that brings me, y'all. Um, I'm saying that I think I read that comment because uh, everybody, that just goes to show that everybody has their own two cents. They have their own opinion. Um, you know, they got their own advice or, you know, um, she think everybody against her. People, you know, offering up words of encouragement or word suggestions on, you know, you can do this and you can do that. But, honey, it don't matter to her. It don't matter to her. Like I've told y'all before she acts like she is has been on jupiter by herself for years that is how she act like for real i've never seen anything like it in all my days i've never seen nobody act like this woman especially to be 51 years old i ain't no way i know it's the lies the stories keep continuing on you know uh jumping mom ray next house then mama house i mean then oh i could get used to this over there at tom hanks house the man with the book who i had to break the dang on sexual sexual book down to y'all and the title was called uh-huh she comes first and i told y'all what that really meant she comes first okay um that so boom here go to um here's the video y'all y'all let's listen together what she does y'all she tries to make herself paint this picture like you know she is just this that and the third oh huh, let's let me back let me just back that whole little couple lines that you done heard so far first of all she ain't vlog she, yada yada okay she ain't vlog nothing she might have went live from over there but she ain't vlog nothing that's the first thing, okay? First mittens, okay? Somebody, you in here, girl. You need to learn how to vlog, okay? You didn't vlog nothing. Secondly, her and Reggie got into it at Carl's birthday party. We all know the backstory on that. If if you was there, then you know too, okay? She was so happy to go to that birthday party. Y'all know she was happy. She was happy to get invited to something, but it didn't turn out how she thought it was. You know, um, the bottom line is they don't fool with her, period, point blank. They don't fool with her, you know, um, and she was like, her and Reggie got into it. Now, before I start explaining that, let me just say this. Reggie's supposed to be her brother, but we've never 
She asked Reggie, bring her a fish dinner too. <laughs> and he said, oh, well, I guess I can bring you one too since you're doing the right thing. Okay. I don't care if Reggie bought it on Saturday. Friday, Saturday, he brings it. He comes by there every week, brings uh, Mama Mittens the fish. Okay, but that's a whole nother can of worms. Why he, he's not there daily. That's a whole nother can of worms. If we was to talk about that. She, you know, their relationship, it probably wasn't like that. We talking about mittens though. You know what I'm saying? We talking about her. She said her and Reggie got into it. Well, obviously, her and Reggie ain't even that close. Okay? Reggie is simply um, telling her, won't you take care of mama? Because she's the girl. You know, guys, you would expect brothers to you know, really hang back. You don't, I mean, a woman ain't going to uh, uh, expect their brothers to be doing all of that womanly stuff with a sickly mother or older mother or whatever, whatever. They're not going to expect that. So, um, her and Reggie, they are brother and sister, but we've never, ever, ever, okay, in all caps, we've never seen Reggie. We've never, she's never introduced him. You know how she do the men folk? Mm -hmm. Her friends, uh-huh, new friend. Here come a new friend. Here come a special guest. Not now time has the special guest been her brother, Reggie. Okay? So I want to highlight that because I'm, I want everybody to see how she tries to flip everything around and make herself the damn victim. Okay, she tried to flip everything around and make herself the victim. And what from what I gather, he was telling her, yeah, be, you know, be more of a woman without saying it. He was saying, be more of a woman. Be, you know, be this or be that. It's what he was saying. Just like any stranger, you and I, everybody listening in here, you'll say the same damn thing about your mama. If you, you the only, only uh, brother and you got a sister, you would say the same thing about your mama be a woman and take care of your mama she flipping everything around Man, oh i need i got needs and you know i've been here no mm -mm, no we're not gonna do that girl please you was down there on the rocks when you should have been up there at her side since this is the mother that you love so much okay we done seen plenty of videos, honey. One day you're dragging her, the next day you love her, then the next uh, time you come and you're saying she got a uh, thorn under the bus, saying she crazy, she got Alzheimer's, and she say one thing and then she say it next. I have seen it all, okay? I have seen it all. So guess what? <laughs> it's my God-given right. I got right to react on what you, Mittens, what you are putting up on YouTube, the things that you have said about your mother, the lady that gave you life, the things that you have said about her, okay? Now, it's done boil down to Reggie, the brother. We finna hear that, y'all. We finna hear these lies, and we gonna pop them. Yeah, no, no, no. You come on, man. Come on, man. The only reason that you're recording, the only reason that you're recording because you don't have nowhere else to record from, okay? You can go to a restaurant and record, but you're going to tell lies in there. Make like the cook. You're going to say the waitress after you, the man that owns the restaurant after you. You're going to say everybody knows you. Everybody remember you. Everybody this, that, and the third. But yet and still, we don't see nothing with, except for you eating struggle meals. Mm -hmm. Only time we done seen crab legs around the time that you done set up and dry beg for money and people done cash stepped you or it's around the 1st or the 21st of the month. Let's just keep it real. Why is it to keep it real? It's got to come from another uh, reactor, content creator, or whatever the case may be. You tell, Mittens tell, lie after lie after lie after lie after lie. 
she paint. She paint so many. Honey, she doing so much painting. Y'all remember that man, Mr. Rogers? She paint more than him. She paint more than him. But the only difference is that man wasn't telling no dang on fictitious stories and lies like she do. She be telling fictitious stories and lies to make herself look a certain way in a certain light. And we got the proper on it every single time. Now, she's talking about, oh, yeah, I, I'm a woman. You, I got to get my grown woman on. Well, damn. Hmm. Ain't part of getting your grown woman on when you messing with the man that say he really got you and he's unconditional and he's your rider from day. Yeah, he got you and this, that, and the third. Ain't it part of a grown woman? Huh? Obey. Oh, well, oh, I seen this. He taking you shopping for a car. You going to tell him, oh, well, I seen this truck, babe. What you think about that? He going to tell you, well, let's go look at it. Mm -hmm. Ain't that part of a grown woman? Oh, 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 just doing her grown woman things. See, a grown, a grown woman that's got a man that's got their back and he's unconditional, he's not going to let her drop her money on the rust bucket, boo. Mm-mm. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Mm-mm. And what you, what, what you want that train for going to another man when you said that Waldo, you and Waldo, y'all was uh, together, he's your rider, he got your back, he this, that, and third. What you want to train for? See, that's how you lost Derek. Mm-hmm. When you was over there on that boat with the black Popeye looking like a skunk. Uh-huh. Only thing he had going for him, you let them women in your uh in your chat talk about his private area. Mm-hmm. Huh. And then in the end, you thought Derek was gonna fly for that, and in the end you lost him. Hmm. Lost him, couldn't eat, couldn't drink, or none of that. I'm just saying. See if you wasn't there, you got to know the backstory, you got to know everything before you form your opinion. You got to know it all. You got to know it all, honey. Let me press play so we can hear these lies. I've been here, though. I've been here, though. Mm. Hey, Daryl. Just say take a picture of the meal. Hey, Twisted Minds. So why is she explaining? Why is you explaining? I already, I been told you. Me and you was right in here when I was live. Why is you explaining and trying to create justification of why you are going that you tell it to get a break? We already know that that's what you do. If, if, if anybody, I don't care who it is. If you meet somebody online and you just told, if you meet them in person, honey, you will let the man get in your car. You will let the man get in your car. You that huh? Ooh, woo, girl. You is naive to be 51. You dumb to be 51. I'm just going to tell you. You is dumb and crazy to be 51. So why are you coming and explaining going to your trip to meet this man that you done met online? I mean, you ain't said online, but I know you met him online. But why is you explaining it? Why did you take time out to make a whole video stream or whatever just to explain that you got needs and I've been here for, I, I'm tired, I'm ready to get out, this, that, and the third. Why are you doing all that? I mean, because it don't make sense. It don't make sense. Cameron says she, see, she full of it. I believe her mama don't want it. And she don't. Just like, you know, let me say this, y'all. Remember when she first had got there and... Mama Mittens went live 
And she was like, yeah, my sister don't fail. My sister don't fail and she ain't even here, this and that. This is not what uh she said it was going to be. She said when she came up here, she was going to take care of my sister and my sister don't fail in this kitchen, da 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 I put two and two together. I said, see that, y'all? Just like the video that she made when she first got to Mama Mitten's house, she made that video about that old man that had got her to Milwaukee. She went, oh, I ain't nobody woman. But that's not what you were saying to that old man. That ain't what you was telling him. You was telling that because otherwise he wouldn't have did it. He wouldn't have spent his money. He wouldn't have got you back to Milwaukee. Y'all see what I'm saying? He wouldn't have did all that. Mm -mm. She told that old man that, um, yeah, she told that old man that she how she was going to cook and, you know, they'll be together and she'll make sure he this, that, and the third. I'm just saying. It makes more sense than what the hell she's saying now. She making up excuses. Right, Cameron. I so much agree with you. She making up excuses and justifications to leave. And what she say just now? Before I pause it? And then we'll see what happens. Mm. Y'all let's listen in. But it's just that going back to my brother Reggie, just with him saying what he said, it's kind of really got on my damn nerve because... Let me tell you. Hold up. Let me tell you something. Y'all, hold on. Let me let these ads play. Let me tell y'all something about, she talking about going back to Reggie. Honey, when you was in uh, 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 down there in Florida, who was taking care of mama meetings? Hmm. Reggie was. Mm -hmm. It was good enough for Mama Mittens, and it's going to be good enough when you're gone. Point blank, bottom line. Okay, so you can stop. You can save all these lies. You wasn't doing nothing over there. Okay? Your, your videos told that. You came and said how, oh, she went off on you. You tried to spin a narrative, and you kept making video after video saying the same damn thing. Yeah, y'all, she, you know, if you want your house clean, you need to do it yourself, this and that. Yeah, because how Mama Mittens keeps her house, you did not even clean up after yourself like that. She had already told uh, people, what, a couple years ago how nasty you was. That ain't no secret. Everybody know how nasty you are. Everybody know that you a nasty woman. Everybody knows that. Derek done told people that. You nasty. You don't take baths. You take whole baths. You take them sink baths. You hit the areas that you think matters, and that's it, that's all. Cameron says Reggie don't like her, it shows. Right. Her and Reggie does not have a good relationship. They never did. While she was in Florida, he been doing what he had to do, but he is a, a man, and it is a difference. Men, when we're talking about uh, a mother, you boys don't do what, do sons don't do what daughters do. Point blank, period. Sons do not do, and not just her, that's what everybody. Sons do not do what daughters do. That's just it, okay? Especially if there's, like, you know, a daughter that can. Being that she was in Florida, Reggie stepped up, and he did what he can, while all she was doing was dang on collecting Uncle Ray Nett's money. Why Mama Mittens wasn't sending you money? You her child, huh? And I believe, y'all, I believe that's, that has came out. That's your child. That's your child. Whatever her name is, since her, what y'all call her, Queen D, Dolores, that's your child. Uncle Ray, Ray Nett probably done told her sister, that's your child. You deal with her. But I want her up out of here. My grandkids come over here. She got something to say about that. She walking through here raising her voice. And I ain't forgot about that day. I was right in my room. And y'all listen good. This is Ray Nett talking, right? Yeah, girl. One day I was, um... On the, uh, I'm in the room, and I'm on the phone, honey, and I heard her. She in there making a video, going live like she always do. This Ray Nett telling uh, uh, Mama Mittens. I ain't forgot about that day. She was in there talking about uh, quality of life, freak accidents. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so Ray Nett wanted her out, and she got out. Y'all, She already had her kids in her ear. Uh-huh. Her, her children was in her ear telling her, what the hell? Uh-uh, mom, no, now. Hmm. I know what I'm saying makes sense because that's the way it happened in real life. Some people don't play about their mama, okay? I mean, it was evident 
that Mama Mittens didn't play by her sister. <laughs> Honey, if you, you seen the video, you seen how she went off mm -hmm. when Raynette fell. So I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. Oh, lying self. All she do is lie. Y'all still don't talk like that. You know, Shut up, okay. lying. Let me tell y'all, and he been coming. He been coming and he been doing things. When you was in Florida, when you was in Alaska, when you was in Hawaii, wherever you was tricking, he been doing it. He been doing it. Whether it was once a week, twice a week, the man downstairs, uh-huh, the white man, that y'all said, mm-hmm, when y'all was out there playing in the tomatoes and you made that video, that man helps her out, mm-hmm, takes the trash out, do all that. Mama Mittens is not, you her child, Mittens, and yes, she love you like any mother would love their child, but it ain't like that. It's not like that. Mm-mm, it ain't like that. So you can stop. It's not like that. So quick, you are justifying that you going on one of your, um, tricking escapades okay you don't even know if you allowed to make it back you don't even know if you gonna make it back or not you don't know what you walking into you don't know what you are walking into you are to me to me just looking at you and listening to you you are your jealousy your envy your hatred everything that came back to uh it's done boomerang it's then came back. It's then smacked you in the face. I mean, it's almost like you're not even living among us. You know, you are part of YouTube. You are a content creator. But, and that's all. That's all that we see. But other than, you don't do nothing. You don't do any, me and y'all, she don't do nothing like the average human being does. The only thing that I see that she do, like the, the average woman would do, is eat. That's it. It's it. She get a plate, whether it's fish, whether it's whatever. Hey, um, it's me. Whether it's fish or whatever, that's all. That, that's the only thing that I see her do that you could compare to an average woman that's walking around, living in, you know, walking through life, living day to day. That's it. It's it. Other than that, she just existing. Like Sin City told her, she out here existing. Point blank. Period. That's all. Hmm. See, he did all that. Girl, you ain't got no thing. So? So? Treat it like a servant. She had to put that in there to make it make. She painting. She painting, y'all. She she painting. She had to throw. He don't do what I do. You know, like being in here, get treated like a servant, got to be up and down, up and down. Why you don't say that when, uh, about them Johns? You don't be carrying on about the about the Johns. You slaying right now. <laughs> I'm I'm um. You know what? Uh, it's me. I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. Okay. I'm telling the absolute truth. Whether it's once, twice, three times a week, it don't matter. He do it. You just said it out your mouth. He came. Yeah, you know, one time she had got a flat tire. He came and he changed the tire. Okay. He came and he changed it. You, on the other hand, if you was a male, you wouldn't have even did it. You wouldn't have even did it. Mm -hmm. It just so happened that you are a female. And you're not like most females when it comes to their mother, you know, Y'all might have didn't have the closest relationship, but your relationship, you cannot stand your mama. And the only way, the only way, the only reason that you paint this picture is because you are on YouTube. That's the only reason you paint this picture like you, oh yeah, I love my mama. Mm -mm. No, because the stuff that we done seen and heard, it does not equate up to love. When your mama was up there on that dang on uh, bed at the hospital and blood was in her dang on doo doo and uh, urine or whatever, you as a daughter would have been right there by her side. That is what the average normal female would have done.
That's what a daughter would have done. And it would not have mattered how their relationship was when they was kids or whatever. It wouldn't have mattered. You are her child. She gave you life. She gave you breath. You would have been there because that's what God says you're supposed to do. You're supposed to honor your parents, your mother, and your father until the day you die. He going to handle all that stuff what happened in the past when you was a child. He's going to handle if y'all if your mama did you wrong as a child, that's not your place. But you, as a child, and he's granting you the, the days that you wake up, he puts you on a get-up list, you are supposed to do what you're supposed to do as a child of God, as a child of your mamas. You're supposed to do that. You're not supposed to let your hatred, let your pride, you know, oh, I'm mad, yeah, yeah, because when we grew up, mm -hmm, look how she did me, this, that, and the third. Hey, Colin. Colin said that's what any child would do. Right. Colin said, sorry should do. You said how it is, girl. So much respect. Thank you, um, it's me. I appreciate it. But it is what it is. That's what a child of any woman, man, that's what they're supposed to do. How, how you got a 70, 80-year-old parent? Mm -hmm. You living there? Y'all got some type of communication, but you know, you know, that's your mama, that's your daddy. You still there, y'all talk, y'all laugh sometimes, y'all, you know, that's your mom and daddy. Every day you're not thinking about the past. Every day you're not thinking about how you grew up. Every day you're not thinking about the mistakes that your mama made. Every day you're not. How, who, it would take a lump of doo-doo to continuously kick their mama in their back. Or kick their daddy in their back and talk about how they raised them, the mistakes that they made. It would take a piece of shit to do that. Like for real. And your mama or your daddy is still alive. Point blank period. And then when you grown now, you got to go slithering back to your mama's house. Now your mama go to the hospital where it's, it's blood in her feces and in her urine. And you ain't even there. You down there on the rocks. You down there on the rocks. Because you want everybody to tap on to your live or your video and because you a narcissist, because you seeking attention, okay? And then you come back making this video, making this video because it, um, it's really guilt. It's really guilt. She painting a picture to make herself all this, that, and the third, but it's really guilt, y'all. It's really guilt. Colin says, grudges shouldn't be held against anyone. God for forgives our sins, so why can't we forgive each other? Love thy neighbor. Yes, love thy neighbor. Love your mama. Love your brother, your father, your sister, everybody. That's what the Bible says. But I'm just saying, it, okay, y'all didn't have the best um relationship. Hey, Squeeze, y'all didn't have the best relationship. Y'all didn't have the best relationship um when you was a child or when you was growing up or when uh Mama Mittens was raising baby mittens. Okay, well, if, if she did, you know, uh, if something traumatic happened to her because of who Mama Mittens, her company was, the company that she was keeping, you know what I'm saying? And things happened to her child. Okay, those are things that she got to take account for. You know what I'm saying? Those are things that she got to take account for. But still, your mama is your mama. You only get one. You only get one in this lifetime. You only get one. You can't go back later on when they gone, oh, I should have did this and I should have, would have, could have. You know what I'm saying? So here on this video, only thing I'm saying is it's just a bunch of lies. It's like now as a 50, 51, a 51-year-old woman, you still talking about these men that you don't even know, that men don't even know, y'all, don't even know, can't tell you the man's, Favorite meal, can't tell you the man's favorite color, can't tell you the man's birth date, can't tell you nothing about these men, nothing. And she puts them, they take precedence over anything else in her life. You know why? Because all she is concerned with is how many dollar bills they got in their pocket, what she can get out of it, if uh, they're going to uh, buy her another RV or buy her some more fish. Mm -hmm. uh, if she gonna go viral, if she ever gonna hit uh, up there with be love or not, if she gonna be the original, she, 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 she. It ain't, it ain't got nothing to do with mama mittens, point blank, period. 
That story with Ray Nat, y'all, we can, we can hang that up. That's a wrap, okay? We can hang that up. She was there. She was living there. She capitalized off of it with them million videos that she made, and that's it. Now she not there no more. Ain't nothing else to talk about. We ain't heard her talk about Raynette and how she's such, oh, Raynette this and Raynette that, and oh, she take a Uzi out there to the garbage can. Um, but she's only getting about $40, sad. Lunch price. She take a, 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 a Uzi out there to the garbage. P.F. John trained her out. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, and she this, and yeah, she can cook, and ooh, y'all look what Raynette made me for breakfast, this, that, and the third. All that, all that, uh, yada, yada was just for the present. It was just for then and just for there, okay? It was uh, almost flunky-based. You know how you kiss somebody tail? You done seen people kiss somebody tail because they the flunky for then and there. Ray, she was Raynette's flunky for then and there because she was under her roof. Now that she's not, you don't hear nothing about no dang gone Raynette. Point blank, period. Everything else didn't happen with her. See how quick and fast she moved from that stuff? Look at the stuff. What was her name? Um, Jasmine. Her channel. Okay, thank you for stopping in. I told y'all what was going on. She made a video and told every, said everything. She said everything that I had already said. I'm going to tell you, girl. I'm going to tell you how you, got, how you got caught. I had already caught her and told y'all. I had already showed y'all. <laughs> she moved on from that like wildfire. Mm-hmm. She moved on that like wildfire. She moved on. I ain't talking about that no more. I, but I told y'all. <laughs> But I told y'all, if you, if you listen good, it'll come out. I told y'all she was a kid to the girl. They ain't nothing. She moved on from that. She then moved on from that. Then moved on from that. Oh, look at this friend. Here go this friend. I met this man. Met that man. Girl, all you doing, what the hell is wrong with YouTube? All you doing is dang on advertising, tricking, advertising these Johns. That's it. And you just put some spin, mittens puts a spin on it so it can't be detected. But, honey, if I work for Dog on YouTube, I don't care. I'd be a dang on P.I. I sure would. You'd be up off of here. You'd be up off of here. She done Dog on show children. Mm-hmm. When she was so dead set on getting Ken back. Uh-huh. She know what Ken fetish is. She know what his fetish is. Had little girls in a lineup. Uh-huh. Only thing they ain't do was strip. <laughs> Only thing them children didn't do was strip. Mm-hmm. Wigs on. Yeah, coming out twerking. Yeah, that was to get... Ken, that was his attention. That was an underlying uh, subliminal message to him. Like, here you go, feeding them children to him on a virtual plate. What? Hello? I'm just saying. Hmm. To, uh, who want to argue? Sure. Let me dive back into this video. Just shut up. It's a big, it's a big ass difference. Let me tell y'all the big ass difference. That man, whoever he is, that she met, mm, did you tell him about your knees breaking down mittens? You told him how you rubbing that dog on uh 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 pain medicine on your knees. Hmm. You tell him how you popping pills. You tell him how you done got cortisone sh uh shots. Huh? You tell him how you breaking down. Nope. You think that man, that man, no, you told a bunch of lies. Uh-huh. That man sitting up thinking you done sit like you do on these thumbnails, showing your, turned around with your back, showing your butt. Mm-hmm. You want everybody to see your butt. That's it. That's all you got going is that botch booty. That's it. Like Derek said, the thing hard on one side. Okay? That's some generic BBL that you done got. It look good because it's a picture. Okay? Because it's a picture. 
It's a picture. Let me say that again in all caps. It's a picture. Now, that's the big ass difference, okay? Ver a picture versus you actually feeling that mug and thinking that it's going to be all nice and soft like a, a, a silicone t uh, breast when you go and get implants. No, baby. No, no, no. That mug botched. One side is hard. It's uneven. It ain't done right. Then you got your scars. When you went and laid down and let them suck it all out, you got them scars and stuff that's covered up because, you know, the, the viewers, the watchers, they don't see all that. All they see is you in uh, dresses. You might be in uh, leggings. So they see, they just see the outside. They don't see the inside. Like I, I've told you, you know, I don't let you know. That's just an illusion, y'all. That's just a, a, an illusion. So back to you going out of town. Girl, you don't even know the man. Like I told you, you are so naive. You are so, let y'all listen. Let me take a pit stop right quick. Let me tell y'all about this. Okay, so y'all know how you might be on YouTube and you might utilize uh, YouTube, you know, for other videos and other topics, this, that, and the third, right? And y'all know how I like to mention Chris Hansen. Y'all know I like Chris Hansen, right? Because Chris Hansen is, uh, he's a great journalist to me, okay? And I think it was years ago when I, I ain't never met him, but what's the word to say? Um, started following um, Chris Hansen. And Chris Hansen used to host a show called To Catch a Predator. Y'all know when he used to, uh, do what he did, and those predators that used to like them kids, um, they would <laughs> come to a house, an address, um, disguised as the place where they're going to meet a child. Mm -hmm. mm. Hold up, I had to wet my mouth, honey. Hold on. And so, when they got there, Chris would come out the room he'll come out the back room and uh he'll be like you know the, the the man would be in total shock okay it would never be the man it would never be a female but the man would be in total shock and chris will start off you know he'll start off talking and stuff but before long the man sometimes the man be in tears begging chris don't tell my wife don't tell my wife this that and that, you know it's this da, 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 da. he'll be begging so the child, which would be an undercover police officer, the child would come out from down the stairs or out the room or whatever. You, this used to be good, honey. Every episode used to be good. Okay. Y'all, Chris now, um, True Crime Daily. Mm-hmm. True Crime Daily. I watch it, right? And so Chris Hansen is the spokesperson for he's the host for true crime daily honey um and you know elizabeth smart honey they done put her on board that she got a job y'all know who elizabeth smart is mm. honey yeah so i was watching it you know by me saying that me is just naive and you know she you know that's just like not what the uh, you know the average woman would do 51, you know, catch a train, a plane, the bus. I mean, to see a stranger, you know what I'm saying? You don't know if you're walking into, you, you just don't know. You know what I'm saying? So, I was watching that, y'all, and the episode that I was watching, um, this young lady, she had one child, and her, uh, what happened was, on her job, she got acquainted she built a relationship with another um co-worker and child they was boyfriend and girlfriend honey they was boyfriend and girlfriend they was doing everything together they was going out to eat honey they was going out to eat on the job honey she probably couldn't get no work done he probably because you know they was they was doing it so other people knew you know that uh they had like a little relationship but the only time she could indulge in him was when he was at work or when she was at work there was never no out in public going out or anything like that right so check this out check this out it, it blew me don't y'all know 
that the man was married, come to find out, she didn't even know it. Honey boo, she didn't even know it. So when she did find out, he done spent the narrative, told her that, uh, yeah, I'm going to plan on, I'm leaving my wife, I'm going to leave her, but um, I just need some help because uh, I'm going to get this divorce. Mm -hmm. I ain't no telling what, how he told her, you know, to have her all excited and antennas up and stuff. And guess what she did? Child, she started giving him money. Mm -hmm. And when I say money, I mean money, money. She started giving him bands. Okay, and it equaled up into to the sum of ninety thousand dollars cash money. Um, when they finally, you know, like when they did um, a search of her house, they found bank. Uh, you know how you put bank the uh, the bands around a stack of money or whatever. That's the money that she had gave him. Well, let me back it up. Okay, so his wife. I'm thinking because they did not say this. They 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 didn't say this. Uh, sometimes I feel like people, like the uh, average person, they could be a great detective, okay? Because they didn't say this on the show. Um, but they was just saying that she was giving him money because he was gonna get a divorce, and they had um uh they had like a what you call it, like a a date. Well. Well, they was going out of town. They was going out of town to Canada, y'all. Canada, right? Okay, Canada. He carpooled. He drove a truck, but he carpooled with another guy. So he would drop the guy off at work. Um, mm, drop the guy off at home. Y'all know what she did? Guess what she did? She got in the back of the truck, laid down, covered up. Until the guy that carpooled till he dropped him off at home, right? Hmm. Y'all know she never made it to the front seat. This is what they saying. This is what they saying that she never made it from the front seat because they only found like cat hairs from her clothing, from her coat in the back of the truck. They never found them cat hairs in the front of the truck. So in my mind, I'm like, mm-mm, mm-mm. So the sister, you know what I'm saying? The sister had her little girl, and the sister was like, well, you know, I called my sister um, that next morning because she didn't come. I'm going to make up a name. She didn't come to pick Riley up, okay? So she said she called her. She didn't get an um, answer. She called, 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 never got an answer. So, boom. So finally, she called the dude, okay, which is the dude that worked with her, the dude that had she was having the affair with. So she told, she said the first time she called, um, he acted, he was like, huh? Oh, I, I, who are you talking about? I don't know who you're talking about. So she said, from the very first time, when she called and he answered that phone, and he acted like he didn't know who her sister was, she said she called her brother, and she said, I'm going to make up another name. Uh, Patty. Patty did. Mm-hmm. She said she told her brother Patty did. She said he done killed Patty. And he's acting like he don't know nothing about her. And the reason why I'm I'm saying that it's equivalent, it's equivalent, you know, um, the not activity. How you say it? the not not the dumbness, the dumbness of some women. Okay, it's a shame. Mittens don't know who she going. She don't know where she going. Ain't never met this man. I mean. All she doing, she come making a video talking about mama mittens. It don't make no sense. If you take that story that I just told you, it has been over 10 years and they still don't know where that girl is at. Lady, I'm going to call her lady. They still don't know. That lady's uh, daughter, she she is now in her first year of college. Mm -hmm. She is now in her first year of college. And you know Chris Hansen, honey, you know he going to go. He went, the guy, the, oh, my lawyer told me don't say nothing. Close the door in their face. If you ain't got nothing to hide and you ain't guilty, why, I don't care what your lawyer told you. Why you not saying nothing? You can give a statement. You ain't got to go into details. Because sometimes your body language and your facial expression, your, your eyes, you, I mean, sometimes that stuff will tell the, all the story. It'll tell all the story, okay? So I just let y'all know about that because to me, that's equivalent. To me, that's equivalent. It makes sense. When I say uh, sometimes women, they don't know what they're doing. You know, they believe anything. They don't know uh, 
she on a train. On a train. I was like, what? On a train going to this man. Don't know where this man is from. Don't know this man background. Can't tell you nothing about the man. What's the man middle, middle name? Matter of fact, what's his dang on birthday? Middle initial. Anything. Where he from? Don't know nothing. Honey. Mm -mm -mm. What I done told y'all before. She, yeah, I be laying across this bed. I be looking at other channels. Honey, boo. And I told her when I was live, honey, you're looking at the wrong channels. You looking at the wrong channels, baby. That ain't what you should be looking at. You don't need to be copycatting off of somebody else over there looking at Vanessa and how she doing her van life. Uh-uh. You looking at the wrong thing, baby. Okay? You just need to uh, stay focused on what, what you got going on. Okay? What you got going on. And that's get because you said you got Gail Stone. That's getting a truck to pull girl stone. Mm-hmm. Stay focused on that. You don't need to be looking at no van lights and all of that. Okay? But at that time, y'all, she thought she had all her eggs in the basket. She thought she was good at Ray Ness. Mm-hmm. She thought she was good. That wasn't going to never come to no end. She was good staying there. She, uh, all she had to do was get the money up. For Gail Stone, she good. She staying at Ray Nets. They both get their little stamps every month. She get her little uh, check every month. Plus, she get YouTube. Plus, whatever uh, income that Ray Nets get. She thought she was good. You hear me? All she had to do was hit, all, hit her little Johns. I'm just saying. Think about it. It makes sense, don't it? Mm-hmm. But it blew up in her face. Like, everything blows up in her face. Everything. If you look at everything, look how she how it how it works out. Look how it works out. Look at the timeline. Look at the timeline. Look how everything has happened. Everything. Something she don't even touch on. She'll talk about it. Won't even won't even address it. Won't even reply on it. She rather address some dang on uh, uh yada yada some bullshit and I eat. She want to talk about that. That's not even relevant, child. We ain't worried about that. We were. What happened, girl? I mean, cause you you know you was live. You had said, "Woo, she can't give Vanessa any advice." Show sure, can't. I told her that. Lying. I told her that. Honey, please. I told her that. Child, I've been told her that. I think it was uh almost a year ago when she tried to put her two cents in some. Child, I've been told her that. She know. She know. They can't give that lady no advice. Sit down somewhere. That's what she can do. Sit down somewhere. Talking about she been on. What did she say? What did she say? Mm, it's going to come to me. Because you know most people go to Indeed. She said she on some other. Talking about looking for a job. Huh? Say who what? You say who? Girl, people don't go to that app looking for no doggone job. Mm-mm. Child, no. And, and, and that's another thing. Lie after lie. No, good and well, she ain't going to work tasting pies. If they gave her a job where all she was doing was sitting down tasting pie batter, she ain't going to do it. She going to come up with some lie, making like, yeah, and they want us to sit in these hard chairs all day tasting these damn pies. Right. But Blind's Pride said, Brad said, right. Yeah, she ain't going to do nothing. She know good and well she ain't finna work doing nothing. All she do is lie, 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 lie. That's it. That's all she do. I don't care what nobody. Oh, that's all she 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 um uh, want to talk about. It's a show now. Mm-hmm. Until I get tired. That's right. Done told you before. Till I get tired. Mm-hmm. That part. <laughs> Boom. Let me press play. Talking about Reggie. Okay. Mm. Cause he ain't, he don't live there. And the and the big ass difference mittens is he does not live there. You do, he doesn't live there. So therefore, yes, yeah, sometimes um older people they get testy. Sometimes they can get on your nerves. Um uh yes, Cameron, she don't want to work. No, she don't. Mm -mm. And we know it. We know it. We know it. We know it. We've seen it. But yes, older people, senior citizens can be testy. They can get on your nerves. They can test your patience. They can do all of that. But one thing about it, 
You got to be a special type of person. And you ain't it, Mittens. I don't care what you say. You ain't it. I don't care what you say. I don't care what them nutty buddies say. I don't give a damn what nobody say. You ain't it. Had to duck out for a few. I'm back in the booth. <laughs> it's okay, Miss Sharon. Because one thing about the baby. Honey, you might have had to duck out. But you're going to catch every word. Okay? She want that fast money just like a hoe. Hmm. Child, yeah. Yes, cat. But like I was saying, we all know that's just a part of them. Yes, they are testy. Yes, you know, being older. Yes, uh, because they, honey, I don't know what it what it is, you know. But it, I mean, even if it's something as, um, if you done been around an older person, child, when they get to a certain age, oh my God, I mean, like for real. They will. You ready to go on about your business and, and do whatever. They, you give them something. A napkin. I'm going to just use a napkin. You know, they will take that napkin, unfold it, unfold it again, and then unfold it again until now you have a big square. Mm -hmm. And then they're gonna, they'll spread that napkin out, make sure it ain't no wrinkles in it. Okay? So you have to have patience that's what i'm trying to say you got to have patience she don't have patience we seen that she, she ain't have patience with dang on smiling i'm glad i started talking about the dog because i think next uh ham dog gonna walk in the room huh. ham dog looked at her like girl bye child please he didn't wag his tail didn't look at her he i mean he didn't show no type of affection call that dog pissy and shitty huh when she when she literally mm-hmm Stuck a towel between her legs and peed on it in the Toyota Corolla. Uh-huh. Did you tell your new nutty buddies about that, Mittens? Hmm? Did you tell them about that, girl? See, you, you know, you never did come back and address uh, that interview with uh, Nicole exposed you on things. You never did talk about that. Like, y'all know how she never did talk about my interview with Derek, right? When she's exposed, she don't come back and talk about it. She only uh, address things that she can lie about and smooth out. You know, wordplay with it. Sweep it under the rug. But she don't, she don't address things that make sense. That ain't no lie. Mm-mm. No, 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 no. She never do. I know I be making sense, honey. She can't, she can't stop my words. She can't, because it makes sense, honey, in all caps, with a uh, uh, hundred uh, uh, emoji, a fire emoji, whatever emoji you want to put behind it. What I'm saying, it'd be the truth. Hmm. Let's jump back into this, though. Let's hear her. Hmm. Will you look? Had me look back and went on about his damn business. Like, girl, gone. Now, listen to what she say. See what I'm saying? She said that because of the reaction that she got from Help me! Help me! Help me looked at her like, itch please. Itch please. And walked on by his business. And then that was the reaction because she felt it. Mm -hmm. Even the dog don't mess with me. She felt it. And so that's why she said what she said about him. Come on, y'all. Y'all know I I'm going to give it to you real. I'm going to give it to you real. That's why she said what she said about the dog. Because why would you, how can you go from, help me? Oh, I love, oh, help me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> when he looked back at her and went on about his business. Yeah, I am, yeah. Yeah, let me take care of this shitty, pissy dog. <laughs> how can you go from, you see what I'm saying? You see the correlation? You go from 10 to 1. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Let me press play. Come on, girl. You can't. Huh. What I told you, you can't hold a, a doggone candle. You can't light a match, a torch, a lighter, and nothing else to know me, Sin City, anybody else that talk about you, any woman over here that look at the doggone stupid, far-fetched, way out in jupiter stuff you be doing you can't hold a candle to nobody over here girl all you can do is continue continue in all caps continue to make these 9 10 11 12 minute videos to get your 1 2k uh-huh 
That's all you can do. But I want you to know this. Most of us, if not all of us, we're just looking at it because you're just an extension of days of our lives. All my children, bold and the beautiful, and as the world turns, you just a whole soap opera in itself. You a whole episode. A whole episode as, as the circus turns. And you just the only monkey. Uh-huh. The only monkey that's showcasing the show. Let me press play, y'all. <laughs> Mm. I guess, you know, everybody need a break. Everybody deserve a break. And that's just it. That's all, y'all. You know. That's what I'm going to get. You know, I have to figure things out for me. And uh, what I'm going to do. So, today what I did do was uh, after breakfast, a nice breakfast of some smoked sausage and um, some boiled eggs and she said she may be an English muffin. I never did see her, though. Uh-uh. No, ma'am, no ham. We not finna drive past that. Did you say smoked sausage? Ain't them salty? Hmm. Why you didn't have you <laughs> some sausage that didn't have, that wasn't smoked? Huh? That didn't have that salty flavor. Ain't you the one who just said you had a clean bill of health? And before that, you was talking about metformin? Mm-hmm. It was pre-diabetic. <laughs> and I had to call you out on that and tell you to stop lying. Mittens. <laughs> now you're back on salty. I had some smoked sausage. <laughs> See how your lies, girl, 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 girl. I ain't never seen nobody like you, honey. You a lie about the color of your drawers. That don't make no sense. Child, let me get, y'all, y'all want to hear some more of her lies before we go to the next video. Zip recruiter. What? What? Wait a minute. Uh uh. Uh uh. What you apply for? What you apply for, girl? What you apply for, mittens? Tell the people what you applied for. Mm hmm. What? Tell the people about your skill set. Mm hmm. Tell the people how many words you can type a minute. Mm hmm. Tell them how many data entry strokes. Uh huh. Key strokes a minute. Tell them all that, girl. Don't leave nothing out. Mm mm. We want to know it because you know how we say each one teach one. Don't gatekeep. Tell everybody what's up. What's on Zip Recruiter? Huh? Let, let us know. Let the people know. Huh? Because that's why people done coined you as a pathological liar that you don't like. That's why. So, you know, if you, um, you trying to do things different, start there. Start with keeping it real. Sharina said, animals can sense those off spirits, and you're right. She put poor Smiley through heck. Yeah, hell. She put Smiley through hell. Hell. Smiley stayed in that little small cage for almost a month. I'm, I'm pretty sure feces was everywhere. I'm pretty sure he had ran out of water. I'm pretty sure he had lost weight. Smiley, I got the hell away from her. He ran away, and even the damn cat. Even the cat jumped off that nine, ten foot dang on wall to get the hell away from her, and I don't blame him. I don't blame him. And uh, we'll see what happens, guys. We'll see what happens. We already know what's gonna happen. Yes, you know, I'm gonna be very, very glad to be here. I have my backpack, uh, clothes laid out, ready to go, okay? Hmm. Mm. She real happy. That's a shame. Hold on, y'all. Let me let me skip past these ads.
That's your business. To call Will. Tell him. Listen to this, y'all. Amazon. What the hell? Girl, I ain't never heard of somebody shopping at Amazon for a car park. <laughs> what? I have never heard of somebody. I, I mean, and I might be wrong, but I ain't never heard of nobody shopping on Amazon. Okay? For no car park. Mm-mm. No, 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 no. What happened to O'Reilly's and Auto Advance? Okay? What happened to car shops, Uh, them, them junkyards? You know, I'm just throwing options options out there. Amazon? What the hell is wrong? Honey, mm, yeah, she, she been locked up too long. Okay? When they did let her go, she went. She found the nearest boulder, the nearest big rock. She didn't try to catch up with society or nothing. You know why? She was so too busy on, on POF and them dating sites. She was so weird. She was so... So busy being weird. Being weird. Just weird. Like, girl, we that ain't what? That's why nobody stuck around. The the Jezebel was coming out on them dates. Them them mad women was coming out, them other spirits and stuff. That's why nobody stuck around. Y'all heard Devon? Devon came out. Oh no. Oh no. She oh, she was too much. She had that. She was mean and that spiritual. No, no, oh, no, I had to get away from her. Come on now, he outed her. Then you had the stripper dude. The stripper dude talked about how she doggone tried to. She talked about Ken the whole time, telling him lies, because when he was talking on that video, he didn't even say none of what I found out about Ken. He didn't say none of that. So, therefore, this is to back up all my claims, y'all. She'll tell a person what she wants them to know. Why you didn't tell the stripper dude that Ken was a pedophile, Ken raped that little girl, Ken went to prison, and boom, when um you were supposed to do the collab with Marshella Wells, Marshella Wells, she um recorded you, unbeknownst to you, caught you saying, recorded you saying, yep, we definitely had arrangement, and the reason why, you know, I didn't say nothing about what he did to that little girl is because, ah, uh, I ain't had no kids of my own. Why you didn't come out and say, tell the truth, huh? I'm just saying, why I had to be exposed later on? Y'all get it? Hmm. Child bye. Talk about some Amazon. Amazon. Ooh! That wordplay. Child listen. Stop dry begging. Well, tell the man to get it. No, better yet. Why is you telling people? Don't we don't, child people that's watching you don't shop at no damn Amazon for their car. They don't know what they getting. It's a hit or miss. And now you talking about something as serious as a car? Girl, go ahead. On um, twenty-two dollars. Okay. Well, uh, according to when you put this video up, honey, YouTube finna drop your deposit on your cash app. Mm-hmm. YouTube finna drop your deposit, so you good with getting your that rust bucket fixed. You good with getting all the parts that you need. You can do it yourself, or when you get up there to that um unmask that the, the mask. Uh huh. Your mask lover. That unknown lover, when you get up there, tell him to get your rust bucket fixed. Mm-hmm. Huh. Um, she knows she being ripped off. Mm-mm. Hell no, we don't know. Because if you know you're being ripped off, uh, Waldo should have knew you was being ripped off, too. He was with you when you bought the van, the rust bucket. <laughs> But you want it to come to everybody. Oh, y'all, I, um, I, I, I got it now. Mm-hmm. Y'all hoes, look, I got it now. Yeah, and I'm going to put this water bed in here. I'm going to put me a refrigerator with an ice maker in here. Y'all hoes ain't going to be able to tell me nothing. Boy, I got it now. Mm. My, how the tables done turned. Ah, that boomerang came back and smacked her, didn't it, y'all? It always do, don't it? Ah. Listen, y'all. Listen, though. Back, guys. <sighs> see I'm for a job. 
Girl, go ahead on. We know you're not going to work. Uh-uh. Damn. Do she even hear herself? Now, didn't shit. Didn't she just say? Let me take this back. Oh, hell no. <laughs> y'all, listen. Let me rewind this a little bit. Now, y'all just heard her say, if I have to, I will put it on the marketplace. This dizzy, dingy, <laughs> don't know no better. Come on now. The marketplace full of nothing but scams. The mar Facebook marketplace full of nothing but scams. She just said she would put the rust bucket on the marketplace for sale. And it's going to be up there because ain't nobody going to buy it. Ain't nobody crazy enough to buy it. Look at the miles it's got on it. Then it's got rust all around the thing. Ain't nobody stupid enough to buy it but you. Now, but I'm finna rewind it back, y'all. Listen to her before. All in the same minute. A whole minute ain't even went by. Listen, she don't even hear herself talk. This is how you know that her brain, her brain is full of mush. Her brain is full of mush. I mean, like that, uh, what's that stuff she like to eat? That, that stuff she called mush that she like to eat. That's what her brain is made of. That's what it seemed like to me. I'm just saying. Listen. Y'all see that? Saving up uh, to get my truck. Wow. I should have never veered off from getting that truck. I told you that. Okay. <laughs> girl, stop pulling. The truck is what I need Stay out of my lives, girl. My Shut up. I've been told you that. I told you that before you even did it. Shut up. Stay out of my lives. You just pick and pull. You pick and pull stuff that people be talking about in their lives, honey. I'll put the doggone uh, um, nonsense that you be putting up. You don't even doggone, you can't even go freestyle. Let's just, let's just keep it real. You can't even do a live freestyle, okay? Because you wouldn't make no sense, all right? You wouldn't make no sense. You listen to me, you listen to other people and their lives, and you pick and you pull stuff, and then you go live. Let's just keep it real, okay? You, I'm, I just told you, you like the mush that you like to eat. Mm -hmm. That is how your brain operates. Okay? You're not on Raynette's level. You ain't on Raynette's kids level. You ain't on Bethany's level. You ain't on your mama's level. You ain't on nobody's level. Mittens is on her own level. Okay? And that's at the bottom of the totem pole. But that delusion, that grandiose, grandiosity, she want everybody to think that she, oh, yeah, I'm on my way. Uh-huh. I'm finna be, I'm at the top. I'm like a celebrity out here. I'm this, I'm that, da-da-da-da-da. Okay? That confidence, mm, ain't nothing wrong with confidence. But when that confidence is like, uh, what we say, unreal, when it's kind of like it don't make sense, when it's kind of like, you know, I, I don't want to use that word, but when it's kind of like something wrong with you, you know what I'm saying? That's when it becomes like a problem. That's when you need to really, you need to check into that, okay? You need to check into that, Miss. And I'm just sorry to say, I'm sorry to say, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Point blank, period. Y'all, Miss don't know what she finna walk into. You heard her say, and we just finna see what it is. Girl, how you go through life? <laughs> How you go through life talking about, I'm just going to see what it is. <laughs> Excuse me, y'all. How you go through life, <laughs> oh, I got the hiccups, and say, I'm just going to see, I'm just going to see what it is. Girl, where they do that at? Oh, these hiccups. Y'all hold on.
But how it suck you in? If you was coming and you was making videos and you was telling us, oh yeah, uh, my rider, my rider this and my rider and Waldo, he oh he gonna he gonna do this and y'all hold on, let me let me fix these hiccup shit. Mm. I uh, hope that works. <laughs> I hope that works. But <laughs> you, Mittens was telling all of us, y'all. She was telling us that, you know, is um, Waldo is this, Waldo is that, and Waldo, you know, he gonna make sure this, you know what I'm saying? Waldo gonna make sure it's that and the third. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not, um, it's not matching what she's saying now. It's not matching what she has said in the past. Okay? It's my only thing. It's just not matching. It, it's, it's just not matching. I'm sorry, Miss. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, and this is not, you know, y'all know. She'll come back and she'll say, oh, everybody hating on me and all y'all jealous and this, that, and the third. But, baby girl, it's just not matching what you have said. Okay? That's, that's all we talking about. It's just not matching. Let, let, I'm, I'm just saying. Let's hear her. You was rubbing it in. Then, then, then I don't know. I, I'm gonna go ahead and pay the money, though. No, you're not. No, you're not. And, no, you're not. Stop lying. you find it out that's a big ass huge and, and how you find it out so they lied about that okay place, but uh 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 ain't no but no 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 how did you find it out that you was in the um you was in the midst of purchasing you was thinking about purchasing that van and they told you that 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 um the van had a certain amount of miles um you bought the van under that but a week later, it started running hot. Now tell tell the people, tell the watchers, how did you find that out? Mm -hmm. Come on now, be real about it. Be real about everything. <sighs> this bitch all this itch always. This is this is her stilo. A new man. O M G, and then. And then she ends the video, y'all. Hmm. Y'all want to see? With that. <laughs> she ends the video with that. <laughs> she ends the video with that. Mm, 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 mm. Honey boo, let's go to the other video. Hold on, y'all.
Now, y'all, listen. Let me um. Let me just uh tell y'all and be real with y'all. <laughs> On this video that we are about to see, talk about, we not even fist to. It's it's really nothing to see to talk about. We gonna look at this we gonna hear it we gonna you know what i'm saying but it ain't even really nothing to see i think we've already talked about it you ain't seeing nothing but some damn trees uh uh y'all see that uh, oh look at the detail De what detail girl please uh, girl The detail on the wall that they got in there. Girl, honey, no. No one cares about that. <laughs> wanna see. It's not like you visiting the damn uh, monuments in Washington. It's not like you up there at the, the Grand Canyons. You down at the Amtrak station. Tell me y'all see the details in that. Girl, go ahead on with that. Please, go ahead on with that. I know you like to wordplay and you 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 really can't stand, you know, for people to talk about what you show, but they're talking about what you show because they know that is, you know, like a bunch of yada yada, if I may. <laughs> they they're talking about it because it's a bunch of she's not e, if I may. They're talking about you because you are fake. Mhm, mm if I may. They're talking about you because you are a fraudster. If I may, they're talking about you because you are illiterate. Okay, when we talk about financial, mm -hmm. emotional, mm -hmm. mentally, mm -hmm. you you illiterate. So that's why people are actually talking about all those three topics: uh, financially illiterate, um, emotional illiterate you know, uh, mentally illiterate, and they're talking about it, and you can't stand it. So, therefore, Mittens comes back, and she says that the things that people are talking about, it is because they are jealous of her. But, you know, I'm just here to speak up for everybody else that says, jealous of what? I mean, not one time. I remember it was one time. I think this was about three months ago. Um, y'all remember she had, she called herself, she said she went to, uh, what's that lady some kin of her? She claimed the lady was some kin of her. Y'all remember she never did show the lady's face when she was in her house and she was laying on the couch. <laughs> and she was like, uh, yes, yeah, a lot of stuff people jealous of me about. And when I was live, I was like, what? I mean, but after that, you know, with the semicolon, behind the semicolon becomes a list. A list supposed to come behind a semicolon. Like, name the things that people are jealous of you for. Okay? Let us know. Name the things that they are jealous of you for. Because I guarantee you, I guarantee you, I got to come back for everything you name. For everything you name. Okay? They might don't tell you, but I will. Because mittens be lying. Mittens be lying. She um she be making up a, a fake facade, a fake script. You know, she's going by that. You know what I'm saying? Because in her head, she thinks that, you know, she's a celebrity. All I got to do is lie. You know, she has um admitted to it. She has laughed about it. All I got to do is say I'm doing y'all gonna watch anyway. She done said that. You know, she has said that time and time and time again. But one thing I do want to mention is that when people band together and they actually start the watch block, when they band together just to show you that, you know, you not all that out here. It is thousands of other channels that people can watch thousands of other channels that they can watch when people band together and they implement the watch block i think that will show you that um what other people talk about 
You know what I'm saying? You not you not you know like better than them. You not um, nothing that you's doing is like uh, better than somebody else's to where they have to shun this person. Oh, I got to shun this person and you know watch her this that and the third. I think the watch block will really show, really show mittens where she need to take a step back and let me do things a little bit different. That's what I think. You know what I'm saying? To be saved. To be saved over here um, on YouTube. Okay? That's that's what I think. Uh, I'm just putting it out there. I'm just giving y'all a little bit to think about. But, like I told you, I ain't going to hold y'all. I done held y'all long enough. But before we go, mm -hmm, we going to hear this. <laughs> we going to hear this before we go. Hold on. She the only one at that damn train station. Poor thing. Poor thing. Mm. Damn, man. Mm -mm -mm. It is what it is. Damn, it is what it is. Hold on, y'all. Cameron said she ain't used to nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all, Cameron. Nothing. And it's sad. It's shaking my head worthy. It is. But it is what it is. You know? We we know she not used to nothing. Po thing. She po tink tink. She not used to nothing. You know. Mm, 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 mm. She not used to nothing because instead of trying to actually share her story and, you know, uh, teach someone else, because there might be plenty of people that's going through what she going through. She rather uh, make like she is some goddess. You know what I'm saying? I mean, nah, this ain't. She want to make it like, you know, these are just decisions that she just choosing to do. Um, yeah, this is, y'all know how she do. Y'all know. I, we done contrasted. We done compared enough. Y'all know how she do. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, yet yeah, and still, it's just showing where the options ain't working out. Um, family life ain't working out. Hell, to this point, the damn van life ain't work out. I ain't work out but but it didn't work out because you didn't listen you didn't listen to people instead of listening to people she chose to talk tell people that they was jealous of her instead of listening to people and taking advice she chose to tell people oh y'all be jealous and suck out my a and this that and the third you know and now look and now look let's listen in y'all Just saying. We oh my god. Ain't nobody in the train station. She's showing. Poe, oh, baby. You know, I do like it. <laughs> now she just said, you know, I I I do like coming to the train station early just so I can watch the people. What people? What people? And we ain't even never seen you at a train station. So stop, wordplay, plastress. Please quit. <laughs> stop. I'm going to call you out every time. Now, when did you ever come to a train station to watch some people? <laughs> when? I've been there since day one. That's kind of cool. <laughs> wow. She don't know the logistics, y'all, of traveling. 
Okay, she said that that's kind of cool that you can count how many people is in the train station, and that's kind of cool. So that is let you know that she does not travel. <laughs> mm. Why would you wear it? She ain't had nothing else to wear. Oh, Mittens didn't have another coat. Mama told her to wear her coat, and it's tight like <clears throat> it's tight like a dress. It's tight like a dress. Hey, okay, me, it's me. I'm back. Camera says, but yet she got options. But Mama told her to wear her coat. And it's tight like a dress. Now, who going to go out like looking like a fool? Huh? Instead of telling mom, nah, nah, I'm good. I just wear this coat I've been wearing. Hmm? And then you got all them options. Why not call your options and tell them to buy you a little coat? Mm-hmm. I'm saying. Huh? To buy you a little coat to wear. They ain't that high. Because it's going to be springtime. So, you know they ain't that high. In fact, hell, I just bought me one that was on clearance. Mm-hmm. But it was cute, so I bought it. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah, I guess. Nobody in there. Mm, 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 mm. What, child? The detail. The detail. Guys, so huh? The detail? Girl, that ain't nothing but... Oh, Lord, have mercy. Jesus. They got a little cafe over there, too. I guess I could go and see what they got. Probably need to get some <laughs> snack on. Even though my train ride is going to be not too long. Lord, have mercy. Let me um fast forward this so I can let y'all go. Mm -mm. We are headed out and up, just waiting for it to take off. So she's on the train <laughs> now. Will you look at the scenery, y'all? Wow. This scenery, and I, I'm just going to let it play, ain't showing nothing but a bunch of woods. That's it. A bunch of woods. Graffiti. <laughs> that's it. 18 willows that's been sitting for years. Mm, 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 mm. Girl, please. She took the cheapest form. Oh, wow, cat. Mm, 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 mm. She took the cheapest form. Um, mm, 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 mm. She took the cheapest form of of travel to go and meet this man that she ne she don't know. You know, um, she hasn't shown a picture of, ain't told a name of. She took the cheapest form um, of travel to go to him um, because she's thinking that you know uh, the lies that she told him. You know what I'm saying? Oh, she going out there. She going to get married. She she He got money. Ain't no telling what he told her. You know what I'm saying? She got money. We Yep, she right. We going to see how it plays out. But for now, all we looking at is some damn dry ass damn trees. Mm. Fifty-one. Will you look? Hello, Brandon. Water. <laughs>
Wow. Honey, bye. He got one like that, girl. Where you going? Honey, what would you do? What would you do? Look like to me, um, your rider. Look like Waldo would have had sense enough before you dropped them bands on Gaston, and then you turned around and put that money on the rust bucket. Now, if you equal, if you take both of those amounts of money and total them up, you had enough to maybe make some type of investment. Okay, maybe make some type of investment if it wasn't nothing but getting you a little one bedroom, you know, um, upgrading your, your equipment and what you do on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I, I'm just saying, but it's like, hmm, you too busy trying to tell people, trying to rub it in. Oh, my, these men and these options, oh, they do this, they do that, da, 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 da. But look what we're looking at. Hey, Renee, look what we're looking at. We're looking at you on a train headed to meet a stranger. <laughs> look what we are looking at. Look what you are giving your subscribers. You are headed on a train to meet an unknown. An unknown. An unknown individual. Honey, you know, Kat just said it could be your final destination. I'm just saying. Kat also said, I don't think she posted yet today. She probably got herself in some stuff. People crazy these days. <laughs> We're not going to speak that into existence. Okay? But with Kat saying that, it's not something that um is, like, far-fetched. You know what I'm saying? Like, because we know the day and time that we're living in, and we know how crazy people are these days. We know how people do devalue life these days. You know, and... Women in particular, they do need to be more careful. Okay? Child, please. Nobody want to hear that. And catch you right. When you look at the lunchable, a lunchable, damn. He could, girl, honey, bye. Y'all, <laughs> it wasn't nothing. It was like um, a nine minute video. <laughs> It was like a nine minute video where she was showing <laughs> nine minutes and seven seconds, y'all, where she was showing the trees and graffiti. Okay. Um, there was no uh facts, uh there was no information about the new friend or the unknown, the mystery man, whatever she wanted to, y'all know how she wordplay, whatever she wanted to call it. It wasn't anything about him. So I stopped the video, okay? Because I know y'all done seen it, okay? Y'all done seen it. It ain't, it ain't nothing that we have not seen before. All mittens do is lie. That's it. That's all she do is lie. So therefore, everybody else, when we um when she posts again, like Kat said, she ain't posted today yet. Boom, Kat will update me. We'll see what she talking about and what's done happen. You know, but before we even get there, you know, it is uh true for what we've said. You got to be careful. You got to be careful. She ain't said what the man do. Said you know he liked this or yeah he got a big cabin. Uh uh uh. You know it's a short trip from Milwaukee. But she had to get on the train to go there. So, therefore, why the man ain't come pick up? I'm just saying, I, y'all listen, I utilize my search bar, okay? I watch certain things, all right? And I don't care. Even if, even if it's not a bad day or whatever, it still was stupid. It's just not something that the average woman at 51 years old would do. Point blank. Unless, well, for me, it wouldn't be no unless. I'm sorry, it ain't even gonna be no unless. But some women are so desperate, so desperate for love. They're looking for love in all the wrong places, and they make some of the biggest stupid.
stupidest mistakes listening to somebody else listening to some man because they their plans their motives that it really he got a motive mm -hmm. but he don't know her motive they're not coming together telling each other their motives hell she don't even know the man you know what i'm saying so it is what it is boom y'all know what's up y'all know y'all gonna hear from me honey and we're going to talk about what's going on, let it on, when it goes on, okay? But as for now, mm, honey child, I'm just going to go ahead and sign out. We're not going to sit here and talk about no damn graffiti and trees and all that. Nope, we done talked about what we needed to talk about. So, until the next time, guys, mm -hmm, boom, it has been a pleasure. With everybody that tapped into the live cat, honey, well, I thank you for coming through. You know, I appreciate it. Anytime you come through and make yourself known to the people over here in TFZ, I appreciate everybody that shows TFZ support, showed me a little bit of love, whatever the case. I thank the people that thumbs me up. Even y'all that didn't thumbs me up. I appreciate y'all too, because guess what? Y'all was listening in over there in the bushes, up there on the roof, all that. All y'all holding you guns and grenades. <laughs> I just appreciate it, okay? It's been a pleasure. And until the next time, guys, it's your girl Kim, a.k.a. The Brazilian Beauty. And y'all gonna see more of me on the next video. Bye, y'all.